pick up a daily racing form. Oh, you mean you can buy those too? You don't have to subscribe? Yeah, you can buy it. Oh, because I asked. Oh, because I asked you. Yeah, um, I want to try to handicap some tomorrow without the. Because oh, I asked you if you could um, get that magazine when you were showing it in Vegas. Subscribe. I didn't know you could. Yeah, pick you it up. can subscribe and all. Oh, that. Jay, Kale, how are you, sweetie? Hi, Kale. Good to see. you. How are you? Hi, Ju Julie. Got Ronnie and Julie. Hello. We're gonna run across town real quick. I'm gonna go to the 7-Eleven cross town by the track. See if I can pick up a, a daily racing form to just uh, paper handicap tomorrow. Ooh, how's everybody doing today? Hi, Toodles. How are you? Hi, Toodles. Let me see. I look a little bit red today. I kind of dazed off in the city. We, we were getting a little bit of sun out back today, so. Teresa Sue, how are you? Hey, not Karen, how's it going? Hi, not Karen. <laughs> I like not Karen. It's a cute name, not yeah. Karen. Like a Karen? Well, <laughs> just always pretty funny and stuff. And, uh, uh, we not like people that are uh, pithy. P-I-T-H-Y. Pithy. Uh -huh. P -I -T -H -Y. Uh -huh. pithy. How's everybody doing? Oh, what's up, T.O.? T.O., the legend in landscaping has arrived. I'm just making a little side trip uh, over, just duck over to the east side of town real quick. Yeah, I saw Karen today, oh my goodness. It's going good. What's up, Cindy? Hi, How you Cindy. doing? I have to sit next to someone on the plane now. Someone sat next to me. Well, it's, it's a short ride. Right? I know, I mean, but I like, like sitting... You act like you're going to Hong Kong. I know, but I had my own... 15 hours each way or I didn't something. have to sit next to someone Holy until shit. today. I like Be sociable, to... remember? I know, but... You're always telling me I'm so much more social than I used to be. Yeah, right? I am. I wouldn't go to all that trouble. Jump, moving here, moving there. I mean, shit, make some friends, right? Yeah. I'm sitting next to interesting people in place. Ernie. Oh, I next, I spoke, sat next to that lady from Windsor. Yeah, Ernie, that was interesting. Ernie Harwell, who used to announce for years for the Detroit Tigers. I sat next to him. You never know who you're going to meet. Right. Did you recognize him or did he just say who he was? As soon as he opened his mouth, oh. I said, wow, you sound really familiar like a baseball <laughs> announcer. I did that for a few years. Oh. Yeah, who are you? I'm Ernie Harwell. I was like, what the serious hell? I got Casey Kasem as a customer. I told you that as at AT&T on the phone. Was he like a midget or something? He was really short one. I don't know, but... Oh, on the phone. His wife, he put his wife on the, yeah, uh, on the phone. She was supposed to go back, but um, she uh, there was a little snafu with the plane and stuff, so it's going to be tomorrow. Yeah, by accident, I made the flight uh, tomorrow instead of today. So Rosie was nice enough to let me stay. I was going to stay at a hotel or maybe <laughs> stay with my stepsister. Stay at a hotel, right? <laughs> We're going to kick somebody out. Yeah. Right. And we couldn't change it to get the same price. It would have been more expensive for, because you're not buying it in advance. Which you're buying it the next day. It doesn't make sense because it's cheaper to fly on Thursday than Friday. I don't know. Not of course this. it is. Businessmen and people fly home on the weekend. Uh -huh. Friday nights. But when this is offered way in advance, I think they're about the same price. Way in advance. Like a month in advance. I think Thursday and Friday are the same price. Did I take the wrong fucking... Up, smelly cat. Hi, smelly cat. So she, um, she'll be gone tomorrow. Cool. Woke up this morning. She first thing she said to me was, "Oh shit, Rosie, I fucked up. I fucked up. <laughs> I fucked up." Like, what the hell happened? Yeah, because I didn't want to wake her up, but I realized it like at six o'clock. She slept. You slept till like eight, right? About seven fifteen, seven. Oh, really? 
Well, I realized it like at 5.30 or 6. Yeah, I'm checking morning mail for work and stuff like that, so. Uh-huh. Oh, you were in there checking mail? I yeah. Could've, I could have yeah. come in and say Rosie, but I didn't. Watching and cooling off. It's comfortable here. 76 degrees. It's going to be chilly tonight. Hi, Amanda. Hi, Amanda. How are you? 92 in Seattle. My That's kind warm. of weather, honey. That's warm. Kale's like, I like it cold, blustery, snuggly. <laughs> honey, I say break out the teeny weeny bikinis, babe. <clears throat> I was teeny weeny in bikini today, wasn't I? Yep. Was that your Dorito? The silver Dorito, yeah. yeah. Hello, Sandy. You're asking mom to move by the end. <laughs> hey, go. Sandy. Yeah, you want I should kick a uh, bird out of the shine shack or what, Smelly? Huh? Oh, so I told Diane, don't worry, but she's getting all the call in the airline. I'm like, holy shit. You know? Chill out. Try to give her some pointers. Check my demeanor. Do I ever seem like all bent out of shape? No. I was, Every Rose. I was Thank stressed. you, sweetie. Ten dollars. Thank you, honey. Nice. Every Rose is a longtime supporter and a wonderful supporter of the uh, channel. Thank you, sweetie. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. takes care of me. I wonder if I can go down here a little deeper so I don't have to miss the 7-Eleven here. Thank you, Em. So Are we going to... Picking up the daily racing... Embry Rose, Green Heart, Yellow Heart, tipped $10 through Super Chat. Hey, ladies, I love the rosy cheeks, rosy, <laughs> smiling face with hearts. <laughs> I feel like an idiot today. I kind of like half dozed off and like... Eh. Diane's like, you better sunscreen? Oh, I got need sunscreen, but I like to get sun. Yeah, I, I like put sunscreen sun on. on. Okay, I was so going to put sunscreen on, but I didn't. And there it is right there, so that's good. I didn't put sunscreen on because I was only in the sun for like 10 minutes at a time, then I went out, then I went back Yeah, in. love you too, Em. Thank you. Yeah, I got some sun today. I was Dorito yeah. bikiniing up today. Yeah. And it was a beautiful, bright... Not too hot day, so it's good to relax. I mean, you know, in a way, I could defer work for another uh, day or so. So I told Diane, relax, we'll just chill out and have a relaxed day today. She's like, I'm down with that. Yeah, and you went to Home Depot? Which yeah, I went fun. to Home Depot we took because a trip to I'm going to put a timer on the uh, water pump so we don't ever burn that up and run that for days on end again. Were we so. at the 7 Eleven before? Because I yeah, remember I came the here and he didn't have it. You made it, Nikki. Hi. We're getting coffee, right? No. We're not? No. Put your seatbelt on. I'm only picking up a paper. Okay. This is not the 7 Eleven. Okay. I can read the chat. Cool round Doritos. Hi, Rosemary. Hi, Nikki. Hi, Nicole. Yeah, we're going to have a coffee, but not this 7-Eleven. Maybe the old one or maybe a different one. Rose is getting her racing form, the horse racing book. That she, I think it's the same one she used in, ba in Vegas, the booklet. She's getting that. I guess only some 7-Elevens have it. The one near her doesn't. Hello, animal. This is my last day, Nicole. I'm leaving tomorrow. Hi, Rosemary. Yep, the races. So we might go to Petaluma today, she said. Not tonight. Which is cool. Brought a hoodie because it's only 80 right now. Let's see if Rosie got it. Yep, she did. Hi, James. Oh, it was good. Thanks, oh. Nicole. Are we going back to the same 7-Eleven to drink coffee or a different one? This way, I just 
screw around at work late summer and I just bet on paper. I don't put any money into it so it makes it a good deal, right? Right. We're getting coffee, right? Yeah. Are we going to the same 7-Eleven? Yes. Okay. Your favorite 7-Eleven. My favorite. Yes. The hood 7-Eleven. The one I don't think is that hoodie. Yeah. Uh, shout out um, to uh, Melissa. Thank you, sweetie. Also, yeah, I did finally get to the P.O. Box today. I know it had been a month. Hey, Potter Pup. And um, uh, shout out, Melissa sent some uh, great bags of peanuts and things there to Honey Every. She, she's so wonderful. That's nice. And um, I got stuff for Bird, too. And I wanted to shout out, Shemay said, make sure you get over to the uh, P.O. Box today, which we did uh, get over there. So... How you revolve so great. Well, thank you, Potter Pop. I appreciate that. A coffee sounds good to me, too. So, I need a little pick-me-up. I think if you're going to endeavor to be good at something, then you should uh, force yourself to do as much of it as possible in your spare time to get good. So let's get going. Yeah, Nikki, love a coffee. How you doing, Nicole? How's the torturing of the old uh, guys doing on uh, uh, TikTok? Going? How do you know they're old guys? It's because she says. Oh. She said, I'm so sick of these old people. <laughs> As you'll say, except for Rosie on it. <laughs> She's so cute. Hey, the Schmetz or whatever it is. The Schmetz. Schmetz. Yeah, she may, if you make me laugh, you're gold. You know. Hey, White Tupac, how you doing? Good to see you. I'm doing good. I'm going to have a real hard time reading the screen in the uh, sun here, so just bear with the program for a minute. We're going to go over and uh, get some... Uh, Coffee. Hi, Noreen. Are we going yeah. to park at the 7 Eleven or are we going to move? Just to get the coffee. We're gonna oh, we're going to move. Okay. Sun's too bright bouncing off the window. I can't even see. Yeah, because in the in winter. In winter time, I have no idea parking. I have right. no problem right. parking there. In summertime, it's impossible. Because last in the beginning when you I came see, here, we How can you there. read the screen here? I can barely read it. It's That's what I'm me. saying because you got the bright sunlight right. directly in there. Right. Hey, Granny, how are you? Nice to see you, Granny of 14. Good to see you, sweets. Haven't seen you in a... Boy, I got the, the A-team in here so far. Unreal. Granny. Everybody. Potter Pop. Good to see everybody. I think we're going to take the back door in today. The missing teen from uh, Truckee, California is really spooky. I haven't seen that story. Hi, Miranda. So I want to shout out and give a big thank you to Melissa for your... Uh, Kindness, which is astounding with the nuts sound sending the uh, wonderful packets of nuts. They're a great snack. They're, they're a healthy snack to have uh, during the day. Yeah, we had those shell peanuts in the shell today. Those are good, too. Yes. Yep. Any ballpark peanuts are excellent. The peanuts in the shell are expensive. Yeah, I know, but they shouldn't be. It depends yeah. on what you get. Yeah. This one farmer's market Stores I go don't to. don't like to carry peanuts anymore because it's a lot of, takes up a lot of shelf space for not a lot of money on it, so. Uh-huh, this farmer's market, I mean this, this uh, fruit and vegetable stand in Encino near me, um, where they have a farm, little farm, they have peanuts in a giant bag sometimes. I don't know what the cost, cost is. So, um. Shell, I mean, in, in the shell. So for those of you who are wondering why uh, Diane is here, her flight is actually tomorrow. Which yeah, is, I screwed which up. Which is cool. I, when I made reservations, Go I ahead, up. lady. Go Hi, ahead. Hi, Aussie. Aussie, how you doing, mate? So I said, yeah, you can stay over, but you got to buy dinner tonight. So we're yeah, going to go. Yeah, I'm going to buy dinner. Uh, I'll buy coffee, go, too. We're going to the In-N-Out. Uh, That's 
tonight. I'm gonna get a grilled cheese, which is vegetarian. And fries. Well, and if I don't you want. You can't eat them all. Throw them out the window, okay? I'm not gonna eat all my fries. I'm not gonna get fries. Unless... Not often I get fries. I get one burger, one fries, one drink. Are that's you gonna it. get? Um, I think that's a combo too. Are you gonna get um, protein style or regular? Regular. Uh huh. One burger never hurt anybody on a bun, so. No, but when you get protein, you get two, right? Nope. Oh, you don't? Never... Yeah, well, sometimes I do. Uh huh. So we'll be going out through the in and out and just get caught up on uh, today and then. Tomorrow we're gonna I'm gonna do an opening of the stuff that came today that I got out of the P.O. box. I'm going to give Blackbird the stuff that was sent. A very kind supporter and sent things, then sent me a letter saying make sure you get to the P.O. box and open up the stuff. So yeah, it had been a while, but I'd been away and everything else. So just bear with me a little bit. It ain't a perfect world. But I did go today and I got it all uh Got it all cleared out. Go ahead, dude. Cindy says, Diane, do you get the grilled cheese? Yes, I do, Cindy. Have you ever had it? I think Cindy's a vegetarian. Yeah, she's a pescatarian. She's, had it. she's a vegetarian who eats fish or she's a pescatarian. Maybe she's fish a, and seafood. Yeah, pescatarian means she'll eat fish. Right, and uh, sometimes crab and shrimp. Oh, yeah. Sometimes and oysters. That's and... proving she's got some good sense there <laughs> to get the good shit. You and know? oysters and all that stuff. Oh, man, I love uh, raw oysters. <laughs> Come on, dude. Goat head. Yes, you do. Oh, you've had the grilled cheese, Cindy? Okay. Uh, it comes with that yummy Thousand Island dressing. Well, it's called That's spread. your juice on it, yeah. That's... I love that, and on the grilled cheese. Cindy said many times she's had it. Oh, many times, yeah. Many times. So I'm going to get tomato, onions, and lettuce, uh, so everything. It's getting hot. Let's see if we can put the... Oh, we're applying that. Let me cool this off for a second, guys. I'm going to have to take off the outer case here. It's getting too hot? Yeah, these phones are, these phones are very sensitive to um, heat. Uh-huh. Oh. Paul, calm down, would you? If you don't know what a joke is, then I don't know what to tell you, my friend. Keep your drawers on, Paul. Is that part of the case right there? Yes. Uh -huh. It's like, dude, really? Really, dude? You're going to correct me like that? You must be new on the channel or something. Well, the in and out is good. Hey, Amanda, how you doing? Hey, Amanda. The hey, great. Cass. Is my other cord down here? Is there another cord down yeah. there anywhere? Yeah, this one. This one. Let me get this, get this sucker off. I can run two things off of one. What else you're gonna run? Oh, that. Run the cooler off uh -huh. the back of it, I think. Let's see. Like okay, you see the blue light is on. Uh huh. That means it'll be able to cool this. So cool. There's enough of the charge. Yeah, I'm actually running it off of the battery here, so it should be good. Mm -hmm. Put that Sorry. back on. <laughs> I know. Like, Paul's like, dumb. Yeah, it's like, are you new to the channel or something? Shit, I do that all the time. That's part of the whole shtick here. All right, so now we got the cooler on, too. So we're charging the phone and running the cooler. Yeah, Noreen, I had to set the uh, damn cooler up here. Yeah, 
Yeah, you got to have fun. You got to play the goat head, you know. I don't understand why some people are like, oh, don't do the, you know. Are you new on the channel or what? Hey, Lisa Lin Lin, how you doing? Hey, Lisa. The triple will in the chat. Hey, Rosemary. Otherwise known as L cubed. L times L times L. L cubed. Remember that from algebra? Hmm? Say it again. L cubed. L times L times L. Oh, yeah, I remember cube. Yeah? Yeah, and square. Got to keep your brain sharp. Yeah. I don't remember much algebra though, but I took it in college again. I took uh, more math in college. I took statistics after high school. Yeah, people love that when I yell like, in the car and stuff. Like I'm a New York, like I'm a city driver. Boy, it is bright. You can't read that chat now. No. Nope. Guy's got his American flag whipping on the back uh -huh. of his chair. Let's see if we can make a Baltimore slide move right here. Oof. I think a cop wasn't behind me. That's about as illegal a move as it gets. You're such a good driver, Rosie. I have my moments. Yeah. yeah, there's a lot of triggered people out there. Nikki, it's good to see you today, honey. I know oftentimes you're not able to make the uh, live chat, so... Okay. I'm buying your coffee, too. You love palm trees? Lisa Lynn likes palm trees. I like palm trees. You They're all and, over uh, Who I else on my chat is obsessed with them? Um, They're all over palm LA. Trees. Yeah, I would never offend anybody. I just joke around. Who else is about it? I can't remember. Oh, Magda. Magda's all about it. Hi, Cindy. Ooh.
4.40 p.m. in the greater Pittsburgh area there. Hold on, Res. Gotta get my stick. Yep. Code head. I'm also gonna... Don't leave yet. I'm gonna take I mean, this off. I hello. I'm gonna take this you. off. You. We're just getting organized here. Hello, Shimei. I went to the P.O. Box today. I'm gonna do an opening to... Hey, Shimei, if I didn't already say hi. Oh, oh, so we have Diane on overtime here. <laughs> That's what I call it, OT. We called it OT at work, we'd say. Is yeah, there any OT? You're working overtime. Is there any OT? Like, people would want it at my job. Really? Make big bucks. Yeah, it wasn't forced. Point, right? It six, wasn't forced. Six days it was, a week. Oh, that was forced. But when you work yeah. each day a little few hours extra, that's not forced. Only so six days. So you can work as much as you want or they would limit When there's overtime, overtime, you can work like, some people work like 12-hour shifts. And slept. And right back the next day. Yeah, yeah, and slept and came right back the next day. That's cool. Yeah. They made double time. Don't you make time and a half for overtime? Only until you reach a certain amount of hours, then it's double time. So if you work a lot of... Well, wouldn't they discourage double time people? No. They only work so much overtime and then... No. It's, it's it, through the union. They have to ask everyone if they want. They have to rotate. They ask... They call you on your black phone and say, do you want to work overtime? And Because everybody likes it. They have to go in order. Now, yeah. in order of the list. And then... Um, if it's mass overtime, they'll post it on the uh, screen, on the on the wall, on the television. We need overtime volunteers. That's overtime. Oh, yeah, let me share that to Lisa Lynn. Lisa, I have flown a drone over Beverly Hills. I have flown over a drone over the Beverly Hills mansion, the Clampett's mansion from the Beverly Hillbillies. Okay? That's when you came and visited L.A. when yes, I was there. Yes, yeah. tens of thousands of views on that uh, thing. I have walked Rodeo Drive. All you need to put is Beverly Hills in my search video, uh, magnifying glass, little search thing. You'll see tons of stuff in uh, cinematic LA, more LA, more palm trees than you can shake a stick at down there. Okay, take a look, you'll see. You remember the Beverly Hill Village? You're That's on the block. Rosie Murphy channel, I think. Yeah, they're on two channels, Rosie yeah. Murphy and Rosie O'Shea. Your, your playlist from L.A. when you visited me is in um, Yeah, but if you just put Rosie in, Murphy. I found the Beverly Hill Village mansion, it'll come up because it's, okay. it's one of the best drone flights. That was the most expensive house in America. Okay. At the time, so. Check it out. You'll enjoy. There's a lot of content. I went with Missy Jen back in the day. Also yeah, and I'm there. If you, if you look LA. at the one, if you look at the playlist yeah. on Rosie Murphy of L.A., um, it has um, when we crash a bar mitzvah, when we go to Arts Deli. It's really cool. When we swim in the pool, it's really fun at the hotel. Yeah, it makes me sound like an ale, like right? crashing bar mitzvah. It was so fun. <laughs> you never know what kind of crazy shit I'm going to do on I know. my live stream. <laughs> <laughs> Well, you had prepared it because you looked. We looked the day before yeah, and saw the out, setup. Lynn. Remember, yeah. we looked the day before and saw the yes, setup. Yes, yes. I hope everything's going well for you, Lisa Lindman. Or we went hours before. I don't remember. She's I think it was always, the day before. Uh, she's always been very kind to me. Thanks for all your comments, Lisa. Yeah, she's uh, she's a doll. She is a doll. It's a really bright sunshine today. Yeah. Like yesterday was very golden kind of yeah. sun. Today is very, very bright. Yeah. Hello, Elmer. Hey, Robert Mack in Asia. How you doing? Hi, Elmer. Hi, Robert Mack. Hey, Robert. I forgot to... Uh, I re met Robert and his wife in person in uh, L.A. Mm -hmm. uh, hung out with them. Uh, you mentioned that your wife had been uh, sick with the uh, cornholio. So just extend my regards to uh, her and let me let her know that I was thinking about her and just hopes that her recovery went really well. Really a beautiful, uh, beautiful Vietnamese uh, lady, just wonderful. Really sweet. I think she got a bang out of me like I was crazy as hell, you know, and she, they're not really used to that. 
Oh, there's a Snoopy. Yeah. I didn't That's notice the, that. That's uh, the Cafe Snoopy. Parisian oh. Snoopy. Yeah. You mean that place is called Cafe Snoopy? No, no. It's just a town. That's the there spot. was a time back in the day that businesses could bid on those things. Oh, put yeah, them all that's around cute. town. Remember Missy Jen got Yeah, I remember that, but I've never saw, seen the one like a he's a waiter, huh? Yeah, it's all there. It's all on Missy. She had them all. Uh-huh. Took time to do them all. So yeah. Shimei, I did get to the um, P.O. box today. It's it's 76 degrees. Elmer. It's gonna be a little bit chilly tonight. person's giving me the stink eye, right? I'm going to have to ram this lady's car. She's giving me the stink eye. Right. So, what, Diane, this morning, when did you first, what was the first moment that you realized when I was, you effed up? Was when that? I was wanting to check in and I usually get a notification on my phone, it's hey, time to check woman. in for your flight. Like the day before, I usually get that. I never got it. And then this morning I looked, and it wasn't asking me to get my boarding pass and check in. So I looked at the date, and I'm like, oh, my God, the 19th. I thought it was the 18th. I was like, oh, my God. And you were like, oh. You and I wanted, until I got up. I was, like, waiting for you to wake up. I was so anxiety. <laughs> uh, you have missed, uh, I'm not sure what, that, what did you send Rosie to say? I don't think it's, I think somebody told Shemay to tell Rosie to check the damn P.O. box, so uh, it might be, I don't know. I mean, I have an opening. We're going to do an opening tomorrow. I do know that Melissa sent some uh, planters nuts, the assorted, the honey roasted, and the, the cashews. regulars, the cashews, and all that. She is wonderful, so... Don't forget, we got Shemay's birthday is on Sunday, right? Sunday, Sunday. Now, do you know where to drill inside the without hitting a cable, uh, thanks, Nikki. I made sure um, to try to use existing fixturing here so that I wouldn't put any holes into the floor. It was really touch and go when I was rebuilding Elisa Marie back in 2000. 19. Every time I drilled a screw, I wondered if it was going to go into the gas tank and explode the whole, uh, whole thing there. Because, you know, as, as you drill things, they get heat and friction builds up on the screw and it gets super hot. And it might go through the gas tank and boom, just ignite the damn thing. Mm -hmm. so. mm -hmm. Hi, Nino, if I didn't say hi already. Great time. That's good. Glad you had a good time. Yeah, so we want to make sure that Shemay is a great supporter of this channel. It's any chance I have a chance, every time I have a chance to shout her her out when her birthday is uh, coming up. She's a young and she's a hell of a lot younger than I am. What's up, Joni? How's everything in the sailing? Hi, Joni. Uh, let's see. Thanks today. today. Now, yeah, thank you. Welcome to the chat for the first time. Believe it or not, I build things. Well, you, I know one damn thing, Lisa. You're a hell of a good cook. I've heard people talk about that have sampled your food and have talked about uh, what a wonderful cook that you are. I think it's particularly Italian food. She likes Italian and Greek, uh, Greek food. So We're going... Uh the office maybe or Chushan in Petaluma yeah maybe we'll go over to the I might go over to the office you built your house huh? wow okay uh, not sure what we're going to do tonight we're taking it easy and then going out to uh, you know we'll drive out to in and out in and out yeah are we going to eat in the car Alex has a question for you yes Alex I had a blast are we going to eat in the car or take it home just eat in the car and okay. we'll go live later at home. We've been okay. in the restaurant since 1923. Wow. Holy smokes. Well, you know, the one place I want to go to in Pittsburgh is Tremanti Brothers. Because uh, T.O. Rosie mentioned we might go there. Yeah, we might go out there. but uh, Maybe we will. You know, maybe we will go out there. I'm a good cook as long as I'm cooking for myself. Yeah. Ah, uh, thanks, Cass. 
Me. Yeah, I woke up this morning. She was on me like a fly on, you know what, on the hot side. As soon as you got out, I was listening for the door. I said, Rosie. <laughs> Rosie. I Before you got up. in the bathroom, I think. I effed up. I thought, oh, damn. I thought, did you pee the bed or something? <laughs> <laughs> Fermantes is right down the street. Come on over. I'd love to. I don't think we'll do a cemetery uh, uh, chooching, but I did tell Diane to put her uh, walking shoes on. These are borderline walking shoes. I didn't want to wear them. There shouldn't kids. be borderline. I well, these aren't those more. black ones that I wore. Yeah, they're walking. They're walking shoes. They're tennis shoes. Yeah, these are tennis shoes, but yeah. the black ones aren't really that I wore. That hurt a little bit. When we walked. Well, I like to go to places, sugar in the roll, and I like to decide for myself if something is good or not. Uh, so things that people have told me are bad tend to be good, and pe things that people told me are outstanding, sometimes they can be pretty poor, so it just depends on it. You like that VW? Where? I can't see well, it. It's blocked right now. That's a long truck. Oh, there it is right there. That blue one? I think it's cute. The blue one? Yeah, yes. it's cute. I like the color. Very cute. Your lip color blends a little with your P2E. Which Diane, color. you should wear a little lipstick. Your lip color blends a little with your facial color. I know. I, I have um, I have a lip stick. I have a Clinique on actually. I'll show you. It's um, I like natural looking. It makes my lips a little darker. But my my favorite color is discontinued of Clinique. No, I've never had French fries on a salad. To tell you the truth. This is the color I use. And it's very light. It's a stain. It's not a lipstick, so I have to keep applying it because it comes off. But it's light. So it does add color, though. It's not like a lip gloss that doesn't add color. And there you go. Yeah, they have lip tattooing. I know, Nicole. You've never worn lipstick. You know, I wear chapstick at home because when I'm sleeping, I get dry lips. When I go to bed, I get dry lips sometimes. Oh, my Band-Aid fell off. Where is it? When am I coming to the burger? I have no idea, sugar in the roll. Sorry, Rosie, I lost my Band-Aid down here somewhere. Well, that's an infection waiting to happen. Right? What, this? No, <laughs> touching the Band-Aid. Oh, it doesn't have blood. It was I just know. It was just around my nail. Uh, your kids are already making paper. What the hell? Huh? Birds but I bees. did to my nail, you guys. How did that happen? I don't know. I have like a... Let me see if I can get it on there. There. See, I have this. Wait. This whole thing. Must be a Pittsburgh thing. This whole... I don't know if you guys can see it. But I don't want to rip it because it'll go into the... I think they call that the quick. When you go below where I you don't know. Yeah. I've, I've been... I've been on jobs and got my whole fingernail torn off, so it's... Really? A, I mean, I could try clipping it, but it's not going to get all of it. I could clip around here. So... Yeah, Rosie looks good with red lipstick, cute kitty. I have fat lips. Yeah, you do. Do your parents have fat lips? Either of them? No, I don't think so. I never uh -huh. really looked at their lips too close, uh -huh. you know. My mom has good lips better than me. I don't have fat lips. I was usually running away from my mom smacking me or trying to smack me or something. <laughs> Jack or lantern. Super glue, Lisa, yeah. The little super glue in there might be good. Unless it'll get into my the blood, the pink part of my under my nail. I don't, I don't know. I could take the pliers and just rip the sun of the Oh no, I, I could do that right now just by going with my teeth and just rip it off. It'll make you tough. It'll hurt know. like hell. Like something out of uh, the hell's that movie with uh, uh, Mel Gibson in Scotland? What was it? I can't remember that. 
things to toughen you up. Have you heard anything missing from day where somebody was putting something in the world that was missing from uh, Truckee here? Uh, you know, are we sure she didn't just wander off somewhere? I mean, I don't know. I'm not sure if, uh, what the hell happened? I hit my finger tore up the time. Yeah, that's what I did. I cut off the uh, corner of my finger there. I didn't cut it off. Some dope was clipping the hedge and came through with the hedge trimmer and clipped off the corner of it. Blew it so it grows. Yeah. There you go. Glue that son of a bitch together. If you want to do a dance video, let me know before we leave. Before I leave. Toenails and job side, talking about that. Yeah, I didn't get my fingernails torn off. The works. The whole damn nail just looking down through a red bloody mess. And How come you changed your mind about the dance video? I don't know. It's summertime and just didn't feel like it. You know, okay. I got a lot going on. Mm. Yeah, the nerves. There's so many nerves in the hands and fingers. And but we made that cute dance video at Christmas time. That's cute. <sighs> see what tomorrow brings. Okay, well, I mean, I could get ready early, and we could do it from, like, 10 to 12 before we have to leave. I have to leave, like, 12.15. Stubbing the toes. Yeah, I don't know what the hell happened up in uh, Truckee up there in the Sierras, but uh, let's just say a girl's missing, right? So that's enough to be said. I hope they find her. Can you share down a little bit? I'm kind of chilly. Are you chilly? Chilly. Thanks. Uh, so back for you tomorrow. Oh, work my for me tomorrow off. afternoon, and then get to work. My handicap in the races. We've got Del Mar, Ferndale, Saratoga, Gulfstream, Laurel, Monmouth, Woodbine, Evangeline, and Penn National, baby. That's enough homework to keep busy for a week there. Nice. Right. Say, do your handicapping on paper first. What does handicapping mean? It means trying to pick the winners and uh, stuff. So, mm -hmm. is it handicapping with football too? Yeah, yeah, trying to pick winners. Uh -huh. I didn't know you used that with all sports. Yeah, sports handicapping, horse handicapping, all mm -hmm. that kind of stuff. So, Carnival and the Calypso to Calypso music. What about race car drive? Uh, are you going to do that? No, I'm not into. I'm not into race car. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Yeah, I've never, got, I've never gotten into NASCAR. It's pretty cool. Yeah, it's a recumbent bike. Yeah. Pretty cool. I've never gotten into NASCAR. And, uh, Me neither. I just racing. like looking at the cars, but I never got into watching the races. Because they make Mustangs that are all NASCAR looking. Yeah, handicap and all betting things. I always pick my horse because it names. Well, you know... It's, Favorites only win one third of the time, so that tells you something right there. The ninth race at Saratoga today, a 33 to one shot came in. So it's not, you can, you know, you're a fool if you go in there and bet every favorite. You got to bet for value. You got to get things that has a chance to get up and win. Okay, because screwing up a few of them can cover a lot of losses when one of them finally hits. You're all good to go. Welcome back, Sue. Thank you for coffee. Yeah, you're welcome. And then I'm going to be doing some homework. Well, this is the best time of year for my jobs because uh, everybody's away at work and stuff, so I can just sit on my ass and and uh, paper handicap. <laughs> mm. Well, the trick is, Lisa Lynn, to, to only bet certain races. Don't bet everything. That's how the track makes their money. You send out a bunch of two-year-old horses that never run before. Good luck trying to find out which one is going to win. But people will bet that. They'll put the money down. <clears throat> There's people that will bet just one race a day. My it. friend um, years ago had a retired racehorse as her horse. Do they do that sometimes? Take retired racehorses and make yeah. them pets? Well, I don't know about making pets. Well, she rode on it. Ship them off to France for food. Ew. What's wrong? Horse burgers are big in France. Really? It's very gourmet, yeah. It comes from the days of Napoleon's retreat from Russia when they were eating horses on the way to survive. They make they used to make dog food out of horse meat. I don't know if yeah, they, they still, still do. do. Yeah, they still do, yeah. Right. 
You love horses. I actually, uh, I actually touched a horse this year. Right. I actually uh, made physical contact with the horses headed to Sacramento, the uh, California State Fair. That's big for nice. me. Nice. What about birds horses big that you visited? Me. Did you pet those? Uh, I might have touched a horse up there. I'm not sure. The goats were all over me. Oh, uh, how they cute. Were going crazy. That's why I don't like goat milk. They're too cute. Cute? Much cuter than cows. Have some goat meat. Right. Yeah. Mutton, right? Nice mutton. No, that's sheep. Mutton is sheep. <laughs> Old sheep, mutton. Yep. They serve that in Indian restaurants. Mutton. No, yeah, I fed it the carrot. That's why. Well, you guys see what happened. You remember? Is that, show me your finger that got cut off. I don't really notice that on the video. See how it's all? Oh on? yeah. Oh yeah. It was cut like a hot dog into yeah. three pieces. Yeah. You don't, I heard you say that. You don't think that? Uh, you don't think that son of a bitch hurt, man? Oh man. Did you get stitches? No, I had this of butterfly closures. I had oh, I I felt pain for two years. With oh that wow, thing. barn plus an inside. That's like when I fell on my butt. I don't know if I broke my tailbone, but it hurt. I went to the doctor. It hurt for a year. Yeah, it. I wore happen. a donut to sit in the beginning, and then it just hurt all year. Went all That's it. for a year. I used a donut That's cushion. Exactly it. Like you have in your kitchen, that donut? I use well, one it's of those. just a pad. For, but it has a hole in the middle. I use something like well, that. Well, no, the hole's in the back. Oh, okay. I use one not, with the hole in the middle. Right. So would you fall down at your apartment or something? I was in my old apartment. This was like 15 years ago. I was wearing um, Crocs that had the, the tread really bad. Like I had worn them too long. And they're kind of plows. You saw my Croc. My Croc sandals were Croc croc clogs like that and it was raining and the steps were wet and I was going down the just a few steps to get to my mailbox and I went whoa and I fell right on my ass and someone was there and he goes do you need help someone saw me fall it was so embarrassing and I got up and by myself and then oh my god did it hurt but there's nothing they can do about a broken tailbone or I forgot what bone it was that I broke they did an x-ray so you did break? You did have... Uh... I had... It was my only broken bone I've ever had. The doctor said it looks like it's broken. You couldn't really tell by the x-ray, but regardless, it was very painful. Did you sue your apartment complex? No, I could have because the steps were kind of shiny. Your they dad's weren't really a lawyer, gripped. right? So... They weren't... And he was your working dad's then. a Jewish lawyer, right? Right. So... He was working then too, I think. But no. That's it. I went to the doctor. I don't know why. That I knew with a tailbone, there's nothing they can do. It was definitely ouch, Elmer. Yeah, yeah. Lisa. Yeah, breaking bones. And I have a small butt, so I fell on my butt. It hurt. <laughs> so when did you know it was real bad? Like immediately, or just I don't like remember. A few hours I don't later? remember, but I know I went to the doctor. I went to my primary. He said, let me send you in for x-rays. And then the doctor called me, one of the doctors, I don't remember if it was my primary or the guy that took the x, the one that looked over the x-rays, but he said, um, it looks like a break and we can't tell for sure, but it looks like a break of some bone, not the tailbone, it was something else. Yeah, it takes a long time to get over that con contusion. And of your butt, oh man, yeah. by, your long, by your yeah. tailbone broke all my toes yeah from dancing my mom has broken toes too I got Lisa. all mine are she broken. stubbed all her toes hammer toes or most of that. her toes yeah everybody stubs yeah nothing like catching that little toe <laughs> oh I just they can live out a bad cuss word when I do that yeah hitting your head is bad well you know you can have TBI, traumatic brain injury. There was a gal that was a secretary at my daughter's elementary school years ago. It slipped in the bathroom and hit her head on the uh, sink, and she basically uh, had to be trained how to talk and uh, feed herself, and she ended up working just dusting shelves in a wow. store, like a make-work job. I bump herself. my head maybe a couple times a year. I open my refrigerator, and I have my freezer open at the same time, and as I reach down, I get up, and I hit my freezer door on the head. Top yeah, of the, that hurts it. like hell. My mom broke both her ankles when I was doing one too on the other as well. Hey, let it go. How are you? Hey, let it go. 
That'll do it. When I was a kid, my stepbrother um, was doing flips in the pool or jumping, and he he got a, he hit his head and he had to get stitches. He had bleeding on his head. It was really bad. He was a little boy. Yeah, how about the idiots who dive into unknown depths of water and end up yeah. being uh, uh, paralyzed and stuff? And he had to get stitches. My stepmother was ready to faint. She faints at the sight of blood. So I think we went. We all went to the doctor. I think. Yeah, brain damage. She slipped and hit her head so far on, you know, the sink, the porcelain is very hard. So it's just, uh, you know, amazing. You know, Lisa, yeah. Terrible. I had to wear a boot for four months when I, yeah, I got in a, uh, I got in a nightclub fight in 1985. I've told that my story many times. It was two on me, and I was wailing away, right? These two bodyguards were hopped up on a coke, and uh, I was giving a good account of myself, and one of them pinned my arms behind, the other one twisted my left leg all the way around 180 degrees, right? So I had to have arthroscopic surgery and wear that, uh, that boot. Man, that sucked. Some of those boots you can take off, right? Yeah, you could tell it was called an immobilizer. Yeah, my yeah. my nephew had one. My my mom said. Man, I had arthroscopic surgery. That hurt like a son of. I was badass, Lisa Lynn. I was in fights all the time growing up in Baltimore City, and uh, you know, the nightclub scene. I have one sister that's biological. This, you know, both parents are the same, and I have a stepbrother and a stepsister. That's my dad's um, wife's kids from her previous marriage. Before she married my dad, they don't have kids together. <laughs> my stepmom and my dad don't have kids together. Uh, Even though they married young enough to have kids. Let me tell you, cushioning serves you well in life. Let me tell you, right? You could have used a little more cushioning when you went backwards, right? <laughs> oh, I'm not sweet, uh, Lisa Lynn. The press reviews are wrong about me. Uh, around the ears, yeah, with vertigo, I've had that a couple times. Like, uh, I thought I was getting Men Meniere's disease, what I jokingly call manure's disease. That's when you get dizzy, right? Yeah, dizzy. Your ears. Yeah. My mom had that. Yeah. But the, they... The crystals, there are certain exercises you do that you have crystals in your ear, uh, and sometimes they can be displaced and out of place. So, you had a face fractured and treated by an idiot that wouldn't leave my condo. Whoa! Wow. Oh, wow. How would you hold the wall, Nina? Let it go. I had a question for you. You got to pay attention to the chat. I'm I am. not trolling. Yes, both of my biological parents are still alive, and my stepmom is still alive, too. Let it go. Go backward. I'll just hit my head Oops, on the sorry. ground. Normal sounds hurt my head. Now or then? I fixed. I fucked it up. One second. Bust it up. You want to fix it, Rosie? You're good at it. It's, it's tilted. Fix it. See, that wasn't that hard, was it? No. How you doing, Joshua? I'm... Oops. <laughs> okay. You all right? You yeah. sure? Yeah. Let me get the wires out of your way here. I keep putting it's my... I keep studio. putting my... Crossing my legs and my foot hits it. Right. I'm a patient person, right? <laughs> it's been busting up my house for almost a week over here. Yeah, I miss my family too. I'm an orphan, let it go, yeah. Come today, you're going to be an orphan. Yeah, anything with the head injury, that's when I was studying special education. I was studying moderate to severe for people that had traumatic brain injury and uh, people that have motorcycle accidents and landed on their heads and stuff. Mm -hmm. and we had to teach them how to uh, feed themselves and 
how to wipe themselves after going to the bathroom. This is when you were going to be a teacher for yeah, special ed. Yeah, it? special ed. Mm -hmm. Oh, ooh, ooh, some pierogies. Yins need some pierogies. Pierogies are good. Thank you for having me. Yeah, it's, it does. It does. Uh, but you adjust. You like to think that your folks are in a better place. Well, I think a special kind of person. It does. You have to be... Um, you almost have to be like an Ann Sullivan. Remember her with uh, Helen Keller, right? You have to yeah, be able to uh, take Kelly a ton Keller. of abuse and uh, just be doggedly determined. And you just baby steps, baby steps, baby steps to get somebody to integrate back into like assisted living and things to be able to partially take care of themselves. Uh, it's a tough kind of, it's a, it's a difficult calling. I guess this guy forgot where he was, where he was going. Yep. So, um... Diane, what kind of things are you going to do coming up on your channel? Promise some people some things that you're going to do. Um, the only way I can hold you to it is to make you promise that you're going to do... Uh, to promise people the content that's coming up. Well, I've got one more Funko to show. That goes with my two Seinfeld Funkos. It's another... It's Elaine from Seinfeld. You know, the... Jerry and George I have. I didn't buy yeah. Kramer because I don't really like Kramer character. Yeah, I'm special, all right, Lisa Lynn. <laughs> I'm special. But I'm going to What do... new thing are you going to introduce? Them? I don't know. Tell when... me one new thing today that you're going to introduce on your channel. Um, a new restaurant and a new churching area. Promise? Yeah, a new restaurant. Tell... I'm gonna to go to a restaurant and do a video. Yeah, where's the vape pen? It, it, the the battery died. Oh shit! If you want to buy another one, I will. I'll buy one. If you want to take me there. Well, it doesn't do anything for you. I know, but if it you relaxes buy the flower, me. Flower, you know, I'd drive you over there, but yeah. that stuff does doesn't. Do I could it. buy a joint, maybe. It's cheap. Yourself maybe I'll buy rolls. a joint, okay, for six dollars. Maybe I'll. Do well, make that. up your mind. Yeah, I'll buy a joint for six dollars. Or... Make really a video like, at your pool. Yeah, exactly. I did, Nicole. If you look at my old video from last year or the year before. No, she means now. Oh, okay. Maybe I will. No, maybe. Well, if it's hot enough, I will. I went in my pool on my on my videos. Buy, buy a blend. blend. Yeah, I might buy a blend. They, when I get towards the end, towards the roach, it, it burns me. I don't like it when it gets that bad. When it gets down to the road. Hey, Dagan, how you doing? Long time no see. How you doing, my friend? Hi, Dagan. Dagan. I call him Dagan. Take Diane to get her medicine. What's up, Judith? How you doing? <laughs> Judith. I spotted her some gummies. Yeah, Rosie's got gummies. How come you got the five millimeter? Don't, didn't they have ten, too? That was Bird Gate. That two oh, weeks from my birthday. Oh, that's right. But... They make what ten. am I gonna yell at him? You know, bird with the buck, you get cheap on me, you know. Well he probably got it it's probably cheaper for the five milligram list. <laughs> There's a special at Mercy. What's the special? I've never smoked a joint on camera. I only smoked a um, Well you can kind of step off to the side. You don't yeah, have to sit there and yeah. blow it. It's been a tough time, but great to see you. I'm sorry, Dagan. Doing some cop auditing, yeah, First Amendment auditing. Buy five fifty in, in fested joint and get another for a dollar. Yeah, um, when you buy something at your head well, shop. Well, I'm saying, look at what you said. Infested joint and get another five dollar and fifty cent infested fested joint and get another for a dollar. I know the place she's talking about. Well. Um, my joint, my dispensary. If you go in the morning before ten o'clock, and if you if you wear your shirt, your higher path shirt, um, you get a one dollar joint. It's normally like six dollars. Is that where you get your pound of weed a week? My or? ounce of your, a well, month. I mean your ounce. Of... A month. Yeah. <sighs> Looking, yeah, just got. And on Thursday they have fifteen percent off flour, so I try to go on Thursday. 
I save like Stay 20 bucks. Stay on the bucks. down low there, Lisa. I save like 15 bucks if I go on Thursdays. Open till 9. <sighs> what the hell was that? Let's see, guys. First race, Saratoga tomorrow. $52,000 purse. One mile on the dirt. For maidens three years old and That's upwards. funny, Kim. No, I don't smoke that much. I'd be coughing up a storm if I smoked that much, probably. Always look for a Todd Pletcher runner. Is that a jockey? No, it's a trainer. Oh. He's a good trainer. He's excellent. Belmont he's Day healthy. Freakness. Yeah, I can make an outfit there. of the day, Nicole. That's true. I could do that. That would be real short videos. I used to do that when I did my, um, when I used to sit in my living room, I'd get up and I'd turn around and show my outfit. Remember? I used to do that. Uh, yeah. I yeah, used to yeah. show my outfit. Pajamas and all and that. Usually yeah. pajamas because <laughs> I did them in the Have morning. Have you ever tried to wax? No, I've never been, tried the yeah, wax. Yeah, I've been really good, Dagan. Everything's gone really good. Everything has been... Uh, I've been really getting a lot out of this summer compared to during the pandemic summers. This has been real good. Getting ready to uh, get retooled for the return trip to uh, Vegas. We got football season coming. We're in the throes of baseball here, so it's uh, busy stuff every day. Busy Biz $5 got me. You need that hoodie? I love my champion gear. That's cute. Love my, you know I love champion I gear. I could have worn, you know? brought my champion black t-shirt. I have do, one. Purple one I haven't even worn. Is it a t-shirt? Yeah. Or a sweatshirt? Uh, it's a purple t-shirt. Oh, okay. I love it. I have a t-shirt. People know. I love that. Uh, I love that. Are you above 4,000 watch hours? Who, me? Yeah. Is that enough to monetize? Yeah, you need 4,000 watch hours within like, I don't know, 30 days or 90 days. Oh, I don't know if I And 1,000 subs. Oh, I don't know if I have that. But I have a lot of, a lot of people have watched my videos, so. Yes, yeah, years ago, Dagan, but I, I have some that are going to be coming up this week because if Diane's here. Yeah, Dagan, my Vegas vids were like uh, four, three years ago. Oh, go ahead, I'm sorry. I think he was talking to me. Oh, the Vegas vids were before the pandemic, For like who? in two thousand with my mom when I went on vacation. Oh, okay. Uh, two thousand nineteen, early I think, like in March, before like a year before the pandemic. Thank you, Shimei. So I have four restaurant reviews coming up from Vegas. They'll be coming up this week. So Yeah, yeah I'll do a live stream, Nicole. That's a good idea. I'll do a live stream. Thanks for the idea. Hi, Lisa. Hey, Lisa. Ooh, 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 ooh. No, I didn't move in, Judith. Oh, yeah, we did last time. We did some chooch and uh, Dagan last uh, Vegas trip. We were out on the uh, uh, we did some pretty epic streams. We went down. I was singing at a wedding chapel with another with the host singer. It was a lot of fun. We had a great time. Really good. Sing a little, doing a duet with the guy that's the singer at the Bliss Wedding Chapel. Yeah, it's good content. That was a good stream. We went down. We also did first Friday going down to the art district where they have the uh, street. Uh, eats and the art and all that kind of stuff so the singing at the wedding chapel was fun i need to get that little part of the video and pull it out for a little short uh video dagon hill so far i like it just as much but i miss the weather in southern california it's a little warmer where i live in sherman oaks i like the weather a little better because it's warmer at night but i love the cities here the walking around the beautiful everything's beautiful here in, in wine country yeah, I'm surprised you haven't been to Vegas yet, uh, Lisa Lynn. Oh, wow, Lisa. So many cheap flights to Vegas. We're called in a trap. Yeah, I'm sure they have red eyes from Pittsburgh. That oh, are she lives in Pittsburgh. Cheaper. Okay. Hell, yeah. yeah. Burbank Airport is like 30 bucks to fly or 40 it's bucks from, right, to Hawaii. I mean, to um, Las Vegas. <laughs> uh, yeah, 
yeah, the crazy dude I couldn't shake off, yeah. What's your favorite Halloween movie? I don't like horror films, but probably um, The Exorcist I saw when I was like, growing up, so that's the only scary movie I've seen. I know Halloween with um, the movie Halloween with Jamie Lee Curtis. I don't know I never if I saw got that. a favorite one. I don't I like mean, scary I grew movies. Up House on Haunted Hill was a pretty wild flick when the chick fell into the acid pit and the skeleton came out. That was life altering. Right. <laughs> right. I don't think I slept for like a week. Yeah, that's why I can't watch horror movies. I can't <laughs> sleep. I'm not sure. A hat on backward. It depends. I might get, uh, if I'm going to be down there for a couple weeks, I might do uh, just to take a room somewhere in a home and just schlep in with somebody. Cool, Lisa. For a week or two. Mm -hmm. I haven't really decided. Yeah, Southwest has cheap flight. Yeah, House on Haunted Hill is really a wild flick. And The Blob, too, with Steve McQueen. And The Tingler. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yes, I like haunted houses, Nicole. Like, I've been to those. Like, they have Halloween special haunted houses to walk through where they have, you know, it's decorated. I'm not a real haunted house. I wouldn't go in. Tara and I like hokey fair rides, the haunted house where you... I go. like that, too. Yeah, the hokey or the better. Yeah, I like that. Where you're jinking around in the seat and shit's coming out on you and... I like, you know what I like at Disneyland? I like the, like, Mr. Toad's Wild Ride and those little rides. I like those. I like Ed Skelton's uh, haunted house. That was pretty cool. Yeah, look up the Tingler. Make People were screaming in the theater. It's like the film broke and all of a sudden you saw, like, the centipede going up the white light. and People were screaming in the... Well, Tia, if you look back from four years ago on the Rosie Murphy channel, if you look at the her playlist, we did go chooshing in Studio City a little bit near me. We went to Arts Deli, but we walked around, remember, we crossed the street. So we did chooch near me. Was that the hand that rocks the cradle? I don't know. That was a, supposedly a weird one. Well, Are we going to show the dispensary? How do you show it, right? I mean, what do you, you you're not allowed to take cameras inside no, dispensaries. No, but I'll go in and you can park and you can be on cam if you want, unless you want to go in. But you can show it from the outside. I think Judith lives in a dispensary every day. I don't think there's anything new for uh, him, her. Mm-mm-mm-mm-mm-mm. <laughs> I had a girlfriend like that freaking Freddy Krueger movies nightmare. I finally cut her loose, man. I said, I've had my last. I don't care how good you are in bed. That's the end of the line. You know, and I just <laughs> I cut her loose, man. I couldn't see it all like, a, you know, putting a mask on and, you know, first thing in the morning, jumping out and with claws. And I'm like, this shit's like, that's it. I'm done. Gone. Like the other broad that wanted to go to Barry Manilow concerts all the time. Done. Uh -huh. it. Oh, you know I can't smile when you... So I thought if I heard that shit one more time, I was going <laughs> to... <laughs> oh, Mandy. Oh, my God. I was going to find a 10-story building in Baltimore and just, you know, just do the deed. I couldn't take it anymore. Astros won 21 to 5. Wow. And then the Orioles lost, I think it was 3 to 2 to the Cubbies today. Do, 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 Good, do. Lisa. I think this just came out, didn't it? Lisa, I like going there in the spring and the fall because it's not too hot or too cold. If you go in the winter, it gets cold. If you go in the uh, summer, it's really hot. Part of the spring and the fall is that's when I usually go. Yeah, I ran for the hills. I thought I can't take another minute of this, uh, Hi, Lulu. this crapola. Oh, hey, Miss Lulu, how are you? I just couldn't take it anymore. Mm -mm -mm -mm.
nice to see you, Ms. Lulu. Are there strip clubs, the Italian place, etc.? Strip clubs, Italian place. Uh, you know, little by little, the strip clubs are just kind of disappearing. One of them burned. They have chip and tail strip still. club. They still have the OG, the uh, I don't know, it's the Oriental Garden or something like that on Vegas Boulevard. They still have the Chippendales, right? The guys. Where uh, they get... I don't know. It's like a show at a casino or something. Uh -huh. The Thunder from Down Under or something like that. So Chippendales is like guys being sexy. But the uh, the old school strip clubs are kind of. Uh, you know, because if you're going, going by the wayside. <clears throat> yeah, they're just not around. What was the one called that, uh, Olympic Garden or something like that. It was down in the industrial area. It caught fire down there. We walked by and checked it out. Got torched. I don't know what the hell happened down there. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Monkey pox at the strip clubs. Nice. You leave a little, you leave with a little more than you came with, right? Nothing like a little monkey pox to brighten your day, huh? You're giving me that look free roll where you're going to go out of your mind. Oh, I'm fine. I'm not going to smoke it in the car. Yeah, I know. I used to have one that would act down a karate move police. And you cut them loose, Sammy. Cut them loose ASAP. No nerds allowed. Do, 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 do. Uh. Damn, man. <sighs> yeah, just don't have the strip scene like it used to. Because you got clubs like the Sapphire Club and stuff. The chicks are basically almost naked anyway. I mean, what the hell? Right, they got the GJ. They're spinning records. and you know, People are drinking five, ten beers. They're never getting out of the pool to pee, right? I mean, it's, you can imagine what the whiz content of the pools is. <laughs> Goat head, dude. Better make this pop on get across till Christmas. Here we go. Use a face mask as an emergency thumb. Really? <laughs> really. I use my baseball cap as a face mask because the Uber I took a, like a month ago, the guy said you need a mask and the other Ubers didn't say I did. So I didn't have a mask, but I had a baseball cap, so I held it over my face in the back seat. Well, look at that class, man. That's like a, what the hell is that, Kaiser? Is it? That's a Packer Clipper right there. Is that Kaiser Permanente? No, that's a Packer. Oh. Yeah, I've been to Seattle. You can see my, just put Seattle in my search box. You'll see it. Last, this time last year, the boss, Janet, and I went up all up the coast, Oregon, Washington, all around. Beautiful up there. I did cinematic uh, videos up there. Anacortes, which is where Janet has a property. That's nice. If you can think about it, Lisa, I've probably done it. I'm always on the go. Is it open land or does she have a house on a property? It's a piece of land. Oh, that's good. But very desirable, very good. wealthy area. Good. Right up near the uh, Canadian border. Oh. You can take the ferry boat over to Canada. Yep. I know someone that lives in Vancouver and they're right by Seattle, they say. Well, it's oh, 
Well, nothing, this is nothing it? like LA, I'll tell you that. LA will redefine when homeless is. I know they got the Everett cams and things like that, but uh, shit, you're not going to hold a candle to LA and San Francisco and you go down Skid Row. My lord. If I come down to uh, North Carolina, the first thing I'm going to do is beat your ass. How about that? <laughs> this guy drills me on geography and roads every night. <laughs> yeah, tons of trash like L.A. on corners. They don't even pick the trash up. Where I live, it's not like that. It's nice. I've been I always over. joke with Jack Cap TV. They need to power wash the whole city. Ventura Boulevard's really clean, Rosie. I'm lucky. Clean doesn't equal good video, though. Right? I mean, but there isn't trash. It's nice. Because, you know what? Uh, monitor the chat. I'm driving. Okay. What's for dinner tonight? In and out. Can you get the monsoon? Well, they need it. This is the Mercy Wellness uh, up here on the left. What's Mercy Wellness that it's just uh, went yeah. Is this the same one? So you're going to ask them about the specials. I don't even know if they have a turn in from that way, do they? We're going to have to commit, and uh, yes, they do, so we can turn in over there. Now open till 9, because there's no place to turn in here. So. Thanks for taking me, Rosie. Yeah, there's Trash Senior Center. They used to beat seniors up leaving, so they had to close it. Do you need hand. gummies? Do I need gummies? No. Okay. Or do you want gummies? Negative. I'm good. Okay. Let's see. We got that sun as a real SOB right now, so I guess I'll just sit right here. Okay. Pre-rolls are cheaper than babes. Well, remember, ask about the special. Free I will. infused, five fifty, and you get another one for a buck. But not a sativa. I'm not going to take Well, I'll give it to Bird if it's a sativa. Well, just, just smoke this son of a bitch. You yeah. smoke a pound a week anyway. What the hell? <laughs> but I smoke hybrid. Right. Another monsoon. Man, I'm sick of monsoons. Sick, sick, sick of monsoons. Do 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 do. Oh man. Wait on Diane. Yeah, it stays super slight here. Well, you gotta remember, I'm on the west coast. You're on uh, Eastern time, Eastern daylight savings time. I hate it when people call it standard time. Standard time begins in November. Let's see. What's the feature race tomorrow? Summer colony snakes. $135,000 purse. That'd be nice. It's big money. That, oh man, I love, I can't part with my champion hoodies. I got all kinds of colors and whites and blue and black and I love my champion gear. A 
Love my champion gear. Nine thirty for I stole my Tatooine shoulder girls. <laughs> Uh, it stole my dad's weed and sold it in eighth grade for cigarette money. Holy smokes! Yeah, I think it's about six thirty-four right here. That son of a bitch gonna be five to one. She smokes a lot of weed, man. What about some panties? What the hell are you talking about? I was in my Dorito bikini today. Do 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 Cause you know I can't move do do boo North Pole baby Read by my great jockey Erod Ortiz Jr. Guy's a monster. Maybe that'll pay pretty good tomorrow, huh? Adidas! Yeah, I had no, I never thought damn so. She's been smoking nonstop, man. I can't slow her down. She buy a pound a week. I'm just kidding you guys. Let's see. Strong light. Is that the one? I, I like North Pole. Damn, that one person picked that. No code. Going off at 113 pounds tomorrow. That's a hell of a weight break. Okay. All right, cut the bullshit. I got some biker shorts at Walmart. Nice. I had a migraine because of neighbors smoking pot and stink. Uh, ooh, we're only kidding. I'm only kidding about Diane. She uh, she does a little uh, just a vape pen. There's nothing to that. I don't think. That's a holy plan, bro. <laughs> she might be buying up the whole joint. I don't know. Target's clothes aren't that cute. Not sure, honey. I'm not sure, Dagan. She'll be happy. She'll have a final good send-off tonight. Do, 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 do. Or under a desk and smoke on that. It cools you. What's up, Winter Storm? How you doing? Oh, uh, uh. oh, here she comes. She's all smiley face. Sorry it took so long, but I had to sign That's up. That's all right. I had to sign up. Did you get your deal? I got, get this, a penny joint for just for, me, just, just for being there my first time. And I got a $6 joint. Because yeah, I want to go the there deal? and just spend a penny. I got a deal of a one dollar joint, and I yeah a one cent joint. Yeah, so Denise did you right. She she sent you down to the right place, right? Who's Denise? She 
She was on the chat. She's the one oh. who told you about Mercy here. Oh. Right? Yeah. I didn't even look at vapes because they're more expensive, I'm sure. But I only spent six dollars on the on the hybrid. I got two indicas and a two indicas free what, and a pre hybrid. rolls or what? They're both they're all pre rolls, but the um the indica um, you get two little tiny joints instead of one big joint. Boy, this and it was guy, only a penny. Such a hard on to get in here. He can't even let me get out of this place. Right. I don't want to touch the Cadillac here. Yeah, first time or wedding roll infused one set. That was really nice. Yeah, good deal. I don't really like I don't want to spend 20, 25 bucks on a vape. Yeah, plus vapes tax. aren't worth it. No. They're a waste of money. Well, they don't get you high, really. They just kind of um, relax. Well, at least me. They get me relaxed. Go ahead, dude. They're not strong enough for me. Heading to the vape shop. Do, 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 Thank you, Rosie, for taking me there. Yeah. I'll give Bert any leftovers. He'll take it. You think? Yeah, I got three joints. Two little ones and one big one. Of course he'll take it. Yeah. And they're not indica. They're hybrid. And, I mean, they're not uh, sativa. What's up, Amelia? We're doing the road rage tonight. Yeah. Are the moon out tonight? That building is crumbling. Yep. Wow. It's pretty bad. Pretty bad. Shit. Like earthquake damage, looks like. Smack those lips. Yeah, I really like Santa Rosa, this area. Is this Santa Rosa still? Yes. I like it. Very pretty. Do you guys have a minor league team here? Uh, we Baseball? used to. It was uh -huh. called the Sonoma Crushers, but uh -huh. uh, not at this particular moment. Uh -huh. Check, check <coughs> the chat. People were talking. To oh, me sorry. Where are you going to smoke? At Rosie's house If when we go back. Let's smoke one right No, it's illegal, I think. Well, it's not illegal, probably, if you're in your car. If your windows, I mean, I don't know. If you're driving, it's illegal, but I'm a passenger. So I don't know how recreational works. MR, no, I'm not going to smoke one right now. <laughs> Rip it, Diane. That's funny. Need your tiny home. Have you heard of Ikea? Yes. They had a tiny home in their store I went to a few years ago. Like, everything's storage. It was real small, but everything was real perfect. It was inside the store. Everything fit. It was good storage and beautiful furniture. Do you guys go on the L.A. freeway? I do, yes. Um, it sucks. I take the 101 where I live. It's up here in New Rosie. It's not bad, but where I live... Oh, it's bad. It's bad? Okay, where I live, you it's bad. You haven't been out at... Uh... Rush hour. You had a tiny taste late this morning when we went down to Home Depot. Right, but um, in LA it's always pretty pretty bad, except if it's late at night on the 101. And the 405. The 405 is hell. The 405, that's worse than the 101. They call it the 405 because you need four or five hours to get down it. And I've heard I live right near the intersection of the 101 and the 405, and I heard that's the worst intersection. San Pedro Freeway is bad too. I heard the intersection of the 101 and the 405 is the worst freeway I think in the United States. The worst backup traffic. What the hell are these dips traffic. doing over here? Jen, Jen, good evening to you. Do you want to walk around downtown? No, I want to get up here and get something to eat. Oh, okay. We're going in and out? Yep. Cool. Nobody in this town cares if you smoke. 
smoke in public anymore. Yeah, but I don't want to smoke out Rosie's car. I'm just car. talking to the chat. Oh, I'm not going to smoke out of the car, and I don't want to smoke up Rosie's car. I never smoke cigarettes in my car. Usually, well, towards the end when I had new cars and I smoked, I, I stepped out of my car and smoked. If I was driving somewhere and wanted to smoke, I wouldn't smoke in my car. Hello, June. Hi, June. Yeah, if I do a live stream, it's going to be in the middle of the day, probably. And I might go out on my patio. Well, maybe they're swimming. A lot of people are swimming now because it's hot. But later, when the weather cools down, I'll do it from my patio. We have a table out there. I can put the tripod on the table. Goat head, man, goat head. Ooh. I already did a live stream from the table several months ago outside, but um, I was having problems with the connection because I was using Wi Fi instead of data and I was too far away from my Wi Fi to connect good. Because from the patio, it still can get to my Wi Fi in my apartment. Weaken the signal here a little bit. There, we got this one patch we go through, which which got a really lousy signal. Welcome back, Panthers. I guess school's back in session. We used to go to school after Labor Day. Same here. Or maybe it was September 14th. Watch the chat. Diane, you smoke six. No, I used to. Transmission is unstable. Yeah, there's a weak area right here. It'll uh -huh. pick up again. Ask me why. Just that one area is really shitty. No cigs or no bueno, Cal. No, I quit. Let's see. I used the pat nicotine patch. I quit um, 18 years ago. Thanks, Cal. What a beautiful Cadillac in front. Wow. Oh, that's a Cadillac? Yeah. Whoa, I just see the little thing. That's how beautiful. I know. Is it a Cutlass? I think it is. No, it's a Cadillac. I know, but the brand, the name that's of That's Oldsmobile. No, the model of the Cadillac. Yeah, it's not Cutlass, no. No, it's something else. Cutlass is Oldsmobile. Was Oldsmobile. Oh, you're right. That's what my mom had was an Oldsmobile Cutlass. That's my first car I drove. It was old. It was a used car. Oh, good, Kale. Yeah. Good for you. Anything on my concealed carry uh, application? Oh, it's, it's been bad. about two weeks now. My first car was a white VW Bug. Cool. My first car was a Datsun B210, and it was used. when they made Datsuns. Now it's Nissan.
Have you had a bug besides your mom? No. Never. I never had one no. either. She had a 66 forest green. Cool. Did you drive it when you first learned to drive? Uh, no, I think it was gone by the time I uh, was learning. Yeah, I learned on a '70 Mustang, a real piece wow. of shit. Wow! Terrible. They called it the Simple Machine 2995, biggest POS Ford ever built. Wow! I'm surprised they brought that name back. What Mustang? No, Maverick. Maverick. Oh, it was a Maverick, not a Mustang. 70 Ford Maverick. What did I say, Mustang? Yeah, I think you said Mustang. Yeah, 70 Ford Maverick. 20,000 miles, the valve seals went bad and it was burning oil at 20,000 miles. What a piece of junk. Mm -hmm. It's like 100 degrees when I went to take my driving test. The thing lurched over the curb, parallel park. And what, a, what a clusterfuck that was. I told my man, oh man, I said, I'll take this. Yes, hot hat. I'll take the station wagon next time, the big 73 Ford LTD station wagon, 429 cubic inch. Like, you'll never park that. I park that thing like there was no tomorrow. And I have a biological sister. Smooth. Both parents are the same, and I have stepbrother and stepsister also. She's four years younger than me, my sister. Younger than me, my stepbrother is like four and a half. Chess guy just looked at me. I looked at him. He looked at me. I looked at him. He said, Well, do I have to say it? <laughs> See, I'm the oldest kid. Did I have to say it? I'm the I'm the boss, I'm the oldest kid in the family. But take it back. You failed. Thank you, sir. Next time bring a real car. was a piece of shit. Do, 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 oh, do, Nino, oh. too bad. Is he a half-brother or a whole brother? Your older brother. Is he half or um, a full, both parents the same? Sister Kale. <laughs> half? Okay. Half. I don't have any halves, but it's kind of cool. It's also cool Bringing the way people. Everybody's pulling in here. It's cool the way on Ancestry you can probably find your yeah. biological parents if they're on it. Different mother, okay. I hope my dad doesn't have any. I hope I don't have a brother or sister I don't know from my dad. He oh, married honey. my mom young, and I don't think he was 25 when he married my mom. Go ahead. So I hope he didn't have any kids before me. That's called being courteous. How are you doing, Joey D? Back to normal. Back to normal. Back to normal. Back to normal. Night, Lisa. Nice seeing you. Good seeing you, Lisa. Thank you for coming in. Thanks for the comments, Lisa. Got no, no line tonight. I think I'm going to get a lemonade. Do you want one? No. I want to get a uh, soda. Okay. I think they have lemonade. like when you smoke cigarettes you just smoke camel I smoke camel lights and I was you know I was younger so I was probably I'm probably more mature now 
but I used to smoke at work and I only smoked for like 10 years. I wasn't a long time smoker. Hi Craig, how are you? Hi Doug. Lemonade? Yeah, I kind of want lemonade. I might not get it. I might just drink my water. Oh, my coffee fell. I still have some coffee left. I still have a little bit. Bread, which is um, like Thousand Island dressing kind of and tomato onion and I think lettuce and I think they give you two slices of cheese I'm not sure I could ask for extra cheese if I wanted it. it's not yeah, on the, the menu the you have to ask for it the connections a little weak here guys just bear with the program it's on the secret oh it's on the secret menu if you can hear me just like animal styles on the secret menu and protein is on, I think, the secret menu. Protein stone. If it cuts out, we'll just start a fresh uh, stream. Let's close some windows here. Open the windows? No, I'm talking about on the phone. Hey Bianca. Hey Bianca. Yeah, in and out. Well, we're getting it here, June. Be when I, before I was a vegetarian, I liked animal style burgers, which is with grilled onions and I think mustard. You like a double? Are you gonna get a double double no, or single? No, double double no. for me. Forty cents for extra cheese. Okay, maybe I'll get a slice of extra cheese. Hello, Janet. <coughs> I'm gonna ask how many slices of cheese they put on it. lose the connection I'll just start another stream when I get better connectivity oops sorry Oh, he's not taking our order? He is, but I'm just moving up. Oh, 
I can help you. Do you have um, grilled cheese without without meat? Yeah. Do you have any pieces of cheese come on it? I think it comes with two. Okay, that's fine. Uh, would you like it plain or with everything? Everything. Onions as well. Onions, spread, tomatoes, lettuce, whatever. Okay. Let me get a number three hamburger meal, lettuce, tomato, onion, ketchup. You want the and sauce? Spread. Yeah, le lettuce, tomato, onion, ketchup, and spread, please. Oh, uh, you want fries and a drink? It's in the combo. Ketchup on the side for your fries? Yeah, they'll give it up front. Oh, okay. Okay, so we have a hamburger with onion, a grilled cheese with onion, a fries, small pink lemonade, and a light coke. Right, that's right. the combo, right? Yeah, would you like a fry, ma'am? No. Uh, would that be all for you guys? That's it. Yeah. In the car to go. Do I pay here? Uh, no, no you'll we pay, pay up here. In the car to go, he asked. For, in for uh, give us to go. I'll be 1344 at the first window. Okay. Thank you. Right. In the car, they're just giving it to you in boxes, right? Yeah. Bag. Bags when you have to go. Yeah. Sweet. I finished all my drinks, my cranberry and my fruit punch. Hi, um, Gypsy, how are you doing? Guest number 16 and guest number 17, please. Guest number I'm going to look at my weave. Check out your weave. Yep. I didn't really look at it, I just saw the case. So these are the little joints, look how small they are. There's two of them, mini pre-rolls. Feeling the little... Well, they're, they're a good size. They're yeah, I've never had a mini pre-roll I know before. you're used to buying a pound at a clip, but I'm just saying. And this is, this is hybrid. This is indica, they only had indica and the free ones, and the one penny one. This is hybrid. He said it was good. There's, there were three kinds of hybrid. Orchata. What are they? You've had orchata, Orchata right? is a Mexican Right, drink. it's a rice drink. Rice water. Rice and... Yeah. I love orchata with cinnamon. You like orchata? Uh, no, not really. No. Yeah. I just got it a few months ago at this restaurant. She went up to... Uh, uh, my friend Denise came on and she said that Mercy was having a special up there. So up on Petaluma Hill Road in uh, Santa Rosa Avenue. I still have my reading glasses. Oh, I need them on. That's right, because I'm reading the chat. I'm just going to put on my sunglasses. You don't like milk drinks? It's rice. It's, it's not rice milk. It's like they boil rice in water. Right to make horchata. I don't know. Yeah, I don't, and they I, add, don't drink I think it. they add vanilla to it. It makes like a milky, and it has. You don't like it, Nicole? It has cinnamon. I love it. See, this burger used to be two eighty-five. It's three. What is it now? They just put it up again. Three. What does that say? <coughs> and you got a cheese hamburger. you got a hamburger or a cheeseburger? Hamburger. Uh-huh. That's I know you don't like cheese. I'm not a big cheese eater. Yeah. I don't know why our signal's so damn weak tonight. I like iced tea too. I buy it, Nicole, in big bottles. And I drink it at home. I don't make my own. I just buy it pre-made. I buy the unsweetened and I add Splenda to it. I don't think Orchata has milk in it. I think it's just rice. Boiled rice. But it seems milky, Orchana. It looks milky. It's white.
Yeah, I mean, I have, and if it's served up, but I really don't go out and buy it. I don't have any ice cream in the freezer or anything. Except when we're out at Pen at you're walking around. Yeah, if you're walking cities. around like Point Reyes Station, right, they and have like, the uh, Palace Market. And we had it in Healdsburg. And we had it in Greenville, too, I think. Uh, no, I'm not. Pot connoisseur. <laughs> She's all about that blow. No, I'm not. I just want to, I've been nervous today, a little anxiety, so I feel like I want to relax. Been nervous and uh, anxiety about my flight. What are you nervous about? About the fact that I made the wrong day. Yeah, that's done. There's nothing I know, to do about it. I know. I know. And the fact of having like to. Like they said in Animal House, right? And when, having to stay. I would have stayed in the hotel, said, but Rosie was kind enough to say I could stay with her. Remember Animal House, the movie when Otter said to Flounder. Face it, Flounder, you fucked up. What right? movie was that? Animal House. I don't remember. I sat so long ago. I don't remember. I leave tomorrow, Bianca. Um, my plane leaves at like 1.45. When they did that classic, they turned that 62 Lincoln Continental into the Eat Me machine. A time to hot box the whip. I don't know what that means, Karen. Mm, Do you know what that means? A... I'm not sure if Prism has that uh, or not, to tell you the truth, Bianca. I guess yep, I would do something like that. But I would never put an open link out, uh, you know, just, my channel has a big target on its back. I don't really like to smell it, really, to be honest with yeah, you Yeah, Rosie doesn't like it. I don't really like it either, but it doesn't bother me that much. Skunky to me. You can light incense, Rosie. If I, if I smoke near you, you don't like it. I got Rosie some of my... I bought a, a six-pack of incense from Amazon Vanilla. It's really good, and I gave Rosie a couple yeah, boxes. Yeah, we'll fire it up. Okay. Now hiring 18 bucks an hour to start. Well, that's good. Unless you have two thousand dollar a month rent, right? Is twenty one fifty top pay? Yeah, I think that's top. I can't read it. Yeah. Top pay, yeah. I think it says to top. Here's my pasta. MR, I just don't like the smell of uh, weed. It smells like skunk. Diane booked the wrong flights. No, I didn't. I didn't. Judith. In a relationship. And if you oh, I didn't know that. Do you remember that? Yeah. She was all about chatting you up. That's funny. Don't you see? She's been very protective. Oh, we have a hamburger with a tiny grilled cheese, fries, small pink lemon daddy coke, there's a 44. Extra ketchup, please. Morning. Ketchup, please. Uh, Judith was. That's funny, Bianca. Thank you. Thank you. Hi, Judith. Do, 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 do. Oh, 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 oh. Hi, Bianca. Put extra ketchup in the bag. Ketchup? And then you have a grilled cheese, one hamburger, one diet, and then you have coke and a sloppy company. Is the grilled cheese labeled as grilled cheese? Is the grilled cheese written on it, grilled cheese? Well, we're going to be able to tell. Oh, we can tell. Is. Okay. Don't worry. Oh, it's open. Yeah, we can tell. Pink lemonade. Thank you. Can I have a straw? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Do, 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 do. Are we going to park here or somewhere else? Just, uh, 
Clean this out. I got a water, a coffee, and a lemonade. Clean that shit out. Yep. Right into the California sun. Yep. Lulu, I guess there's no in and out near you, or maybe there is. Where does Lulu live? Do you know? Lulu. Uh, I believe that she lives in, I think, in uh, Indiana. Oh, okay. My my nephews go to University of Indiana if you live there, Lulu. She in, is an Indiana gal, I believe. My nephews are both uh, living in, in Bloomington, they're brothers, and they both go to University of, of Indiana. Who's Did they get your order right? Yep. Well, I didn't look at it. I just looked at the beside your burger. Yeah, they got it right. One has no penny. should have asked them to put the grilled cheese in a separate bag. You know why? I don't really like meat vapors on my um, sandwich. Well, I don't like pot vapors in my clothes. Because <laughs> I'm a vegetarian. Down. Yeah, it doesn't slow you down any. <laughs> Sometimes we just have to deal with stuff in life. You know, I know. You know? Meat vapors, you should be blessed that you're... You know, meat is so damn good. Oh, I like the taste of meat, don't get me wrong. It just grossed me out. Never Tomorrow been I'm going to have a meat frenzy. I'm going to throw a big ass steak on it. Hot vapor, hot huh, rose, that's cute. <laughs> Jane into those oh, meat Oh, Lori, vapors. hi. She's calling hey, my Lori. friend Lori. Hello. Lori, we're going in and out and I'm coming home tomorrow, Lori. Wouldn't you like living up on the res? What's the res? I think she meant living on resin. Resin? Like from pot? Yeah. No, I don't like resin. Smoke up that res. No, I don't smoke, like, the end of a joint I throw out. I can't smoke it. It's too strong. Save it for bird. And he makes save it for bird. Out of it. Right. He kicks them all together and makes a joint, right? Yeah. You're going to the reservation? Are you going to a, um, you're going to an Indian reservation? That's cool. Bianca. I think she meant no reservation for the Anthony Moore Day show. Oh. No reservation. This isn't... It's, it's not showing new comments. It's okay. Relax. Relax. Oh, there we go. I'll smoke one when I get back. I'll smoke a joint when I get to Rose's house. Yum, yum, dear me. around that corner. Rosie says, Lori says, venison. Yak, Rosie. Yak, yes. Venison. Good eating, huh, Lori? <laughs> Fire it up. Have a little bit of mutton on the side. <laughs> nice gamey mutton chops. Yeah. Lori, does our 
job even exist anymore? Are there still people answering 611 for landlines? I mean, is that office still, are people still working there? Cell phones is definitely still a thing, but on landlines. Oh, Jeffrey Peterson, I'm friends with him, but I I stopped following him because he posts a lot of political stuff and I don't like it. So I, I'm friends with him, but I stopped following him on Facebook. I didn't do that. What is his off? Yeah, I don't want to see his posts. It's yeah. all political. His cartoons. her phone through her cable company. She has like a internet phone and they have repair for that, but it's it's through cable, it's not through AT&T. Yeah, they were so far in the box, it's from Elsa. Rabbit season, you know? Do you eat rabbit, Bianca? Yeah. I think it was weird. The guy in the post office offered his duck to Voice, V O I P. The guy at the post office, you want some duck? Yeah, maybe our job still uh -huh. exists. What? The duck at the post office. Oh, the office. duck at the post office. Yeah, Lori, maybe V O I P, I think, was was uh, was an internet phone with ATT when you get broadband. Yeah, that might exist. And we did repair tickets for that, too. Oh, when it yeah, was he, had, he had frozen duck. He was, hey, y'all want some duck? You've had rabbit, Bianca? Wow. I've had duck in a Chinese restaurant. Oh, you got to carry the bag in. I got all this okay, other shit. Okay, I'll carry all my other shit. Yeah, dump your stuff in the trash can now. Yeah. Or... While well, I'm dumping is the coffee, I'm keeping the water in the lemonade. Dump that shit out. Look at that lawn, man. PGA. Woo. Seated lawn. Do, 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 do. I got packages from the post office for bird today. Throw this out there because I can't lift the lid with all this stuff. So I'll throw this out in your kitchen. The coffee. Hey, Blackbird. I got uh, some stuff came in the mail for you. Really? Yeah, it's probably been at the post office for a while, but I just got up there today. Someone said I had a package like a week ago, but I. You told me, yeah, because. I wonder if they give us napkins. I need to look. Yes, they give us napkins. Here you go, Blackbird. 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 
just going potty, Rosie. Blackbird! Blackbird, I might have a joint to give you if I don't finish them. I got a couple oh, joints. No worries. I have if I have some left over, I'll give it to you. I have part if you need Okay. To. Okay. Thank thanks. you. I'm going to go to the bathroom. Rosie, we tell the people put a letter or something because I don't know where it comes from. Can you help me? Yeah, I don't know. You're going to have to open it up and talk to your chat. Where come from? Oh, Maybe something it. will be inside of it, so check it out. Okay. Thank I'm you, opening, Rosie. I got some stuff, too. I'm going to open it in the morning for me. Ooh, 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 ooh. Paper straws. Oh, it's going to be cold tonight. Sandals, you guys, because cough, coffee spilled all over my tennis shoes, so I'm gonna have to wash them when I get home. I put them in the machine. Coffee spilled on my sneakers. I hope it didn't get on your floor too much. I had a little bit in there. Is that okay? No, get this shampoo we're at and clean my floor tomorrow. <laughs> I know your floor isn't real clean, so it wouldn't really matter if a little dark got on it. Right. A little water. It wasn't a lot. But it, enough to get my shoe, because it was by my shoe. Alright, so, so these are my croc sandals. Yeah, Anybody like crocs? They say crocs on them. They're really comfortable. I'm wearing them with socks right now. I didn't feel like putting shoes on. I got lemonade. Well, while I'm here, I'll show you guys my weed that I got. Oh, well, let me see if anybody's chatting to me. Sorry, I can't see with anybody. Oh, thanks, Lulu. Okay, I got, you have some Yeezy slides, yeah. These are really comfy. They're like 50 bucks or 60 bucks. I got them on Zappos, but they have them on Crocs.com too. I got, I think I got these on Zappos, they have Crocs. They're Croc sandals, and they're unisex. They come in men's and women's size. It's the same, unisex. Oh, Lori, rain and thunderstorms. It's about, it was about 80 here. I don't know what the temp is now. But it was hot in the valley today where I live in Sherman Oaks. So here's what I got. These, are, these were a penny because I'm a new customer, and they're indica selfies. They're two little joints, really tiny ones. And then this is a bigger joint. It's it's hybrid. It's called Puff Balance, and it's horchata flavored, or that's the strain. So I got that. Oh, thank you, Nina. This was six bucks, and this was a penny because I'm new, a new customer. I had to sign that. That's what took so a while. And there was a line. I don't know, Jay. It depends on when Rosie asks me back and if I'm available. If Rosie asks me to come up here, I will, but I don't know when, if I'm available. Let me sit back down. Mm. 
You sent drugs to the ranch show to Backbird. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, I guess you could send it without a return address, and who knows if it would get scanned. That's Cali style. I know, it is Cali style. They do that in Reno. I know, I just didn't feel like putting shoes on, so I put these slides on. Slide slip, slip ons. See, I'm wearing my sandals and my socks. Yep. I showed them to the chat. Oh, I got coffee on my sock, too. Look. Yep. I got coffee on my sock. Everything. I'm gonna go get my hoodie, Rancy. I'm a little chilly. Oh, I think I left my hoodie in your car. I'm not sure. Sorry. Chad, go, go. Do you want plates, Rosie? Yeah. Okay. The copper, the metal ones? Yeah, the metal Okay. Does that look good? That's from Ms. Lulu. Isn't that wonderful? Love that. Love that. Yep, metal plates. Plat they're tin or metal or something. Mine. Yours. I have mine. Mine are, mine are Ray Bans. Yep, they Ray Ban. the grilled cheese and meat papers. <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll open the bag. How's that? No. Keep it hot by closing it. And my burger bun is touching her burger bun. The meat isn't touching my burger, though. So if the meat was touching my burger, I'd be a little bit, eh, I probably wouldn't eat it. Hi, Santa Anna. Oh, 
Oh, Jean, I love vanilla ice cream. My hair is a mess. I've been in the wind. I might put a hat on because my hair is a mess. Extra ketchup. Thank you. Oh, there's meat on that one, maybe. So I won't have that one. You want it? Which one's meat? It's, it's got stuff on it. Yum, yum, meat. Yum, yum, yum. Meat, meat, meat. Here's mine, folks. It just has two pieces of cheese and spread. Mmm, delicious. Meat, the meaty one. Ice cold is good. I'm gonna change my drawers. really good. Hi Scottish. I've had them Gypsy. They're good. Very good. They also have at Burger King an egg cheese and egg and cheese croissant without meat. How's your excellent I've already eaten like half of it. <laughs> We've been having the apple pie for breakfast every day. Mm -hmm. Enough for tomorrow. It's made a good breakfast, hasn't it? Yeah, I don't do cold. I'm going to put on long pants, it's cold. Damn right, it's cold. Colder than the witches. Grilled cheese with pork roll. The more meatier, the better. Fries taste good, they're a little on the cold side. Mmm. Pecan pie. Hey P2E. Hey Dave. How you doing tonight? They're good. They're just not warm. Thank you, Sammy. Can't get used to paper straws. Dinners from In and Out. In and Out. I'm going to be opening the uh, 
some packages came to the P.O. box. I'm going to be opening them tomorrow morning. They do suck. It gets cold at night daily. Uh, Dixie, you don't get down to the, uh, you know, the uh, low to mid 40s, not now, but in October. And then after Halloween, it's like somebody flips a switch and then boom, we go down to, really, I guess after Thanksgiving. December is the coldest month. Yeah, unboxing tomorrow. I know it's a couple weeks since I got to the, probably a month. Well, uh, I've got long pants on, you guys, because it's cold. It's very cold. Some guy comes into the post office with a bag of frozen duck. <laughs> that was weird. I don't hear any cats fighting. Kids are running around. Cold is here in South Florida. Nice gypsy. Some of the cheese came off the burger. Very good. No, I've never done a meet and greet, Sammy. But there's nobody that's met more people than I have on YouTube. <laughs> You believe it, Rosie? I ate the whole thing. You want to say I only eat a little bit? I ate the whole thing. I dread winter. Strictly from late spring to late fall, and then boom. No, it's your ketchup, you know, it's not fries. It's ketchup. No, Rosie got fries. I didn't get fries. I can't eat fries and a burger. It's too much for me. I can eat a few fries, but not a whole fries. Yeah, I did, Sammy. It does, the sauce. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Good thing I brought long pants, Rosie. You told me to bring long pants. I always bring long yeah. pants. I love summer too. Yeah, I yeah. love summer. The heat was. Yeah, I heard Texas was really brutal. I pruned my fruit trees already about a month ago. As soon as the fruit falls, I trim them back. It saves me a lot of hassle. Next year is going to be a light year. I guess I'll light one of these puppies up. I'll stand over there. I'll light the hybrid up. You can just sit down, turn the camera to me, just light it up. Enjoy. Okay. But I'll, I'll blow it, it this way. Me. Okay. I can figure out how to open it. Remove salesman. What the hell does that mean? Can you figure out how to open this? The other one, the, the uh, you just pop it like that. Oh, thank you. 
Oh, it's so little. Look, you guys. It's a little to be roll. Yeah, the Orioles are kind of sputtering right now. They playing too hot for a while, so I think they lost three to two. Oh yeah, Amelia, I did all the electrical here. I went from 50 to 200 amp. Yeah. Sammy, I don't talk about that on live streams here. How is it? You want to try it? No, you don't like it. Are you kidding me? You won't even try a vape, Christ. so you can try this. You want to try me? No worries, Sammy. I think everything was like thirteen dollars, right? Something like that tonight. For this, yeah. For everything yeah, Diane that. bought tonight. The receipt is in my pants spot, my shorts. I don't have it. Mm -hmm. Oh, funny to you. In and out just uh, such a good solid burger. Mm, mm, mm. Good grilled cheese too. Very good. I eat the whole thing. Enjoying that? Hmm? Yeah, it's okay. I like my bongs better and I like bongs better than this. But this is better than a vape. Vapes make me cough. This doesn't really make me cough. Show me how you blow that, baby. <laughs> uh, any regrets? Not really, Amelia. Things turned out much better than I ever thought that they would. Yeah. My big problems have been landscaping and stuff like that. In the house has been wonderful. Hi Thomas, how are you? Hi Thomas. I know you're my go-to guy for landscaping, but I tell you, outside was a hell of a lot of hell of a struggle. Thank you, Amar. It still is. You don't cough, you don't get off anyway. Well, absurdly, I coughed a lot on that vape, and it barely got me buzzed. So. I'm not coughing off this joint, I'm coughing I got it this place, had three buildings to do. Mm -hmm. Oh, cool, Crow. I wouldn't dream of hiring another one except you. Well, thank you, Judy. Yeah, I'm showing weed, Bobby. Hey, Bobby. This is a, was a joint. <laughs> yeah, thank you, Amelia. Uh, those were hard days here. Handling the smoke, okay, Rosie? Mm -hmm. 
I'm trying to blow it this way. Diane, you smoke beside when eating. Well, Rosie said it was okay. I would have moved if Rosie didn't let me go. Hi, Ty. What's on your burger, Rosie? Hmm? He asked what's on your burger. Mine, mine was cheese. That is tomato, onion, joy juice, and ketchup. That, you had spread, right? Mm -hmm. I had spread cheese, two slices of cheese, spread, um, what do you call it, um, tomato, lettuce, and onion, but just cheese, no meat. Orchata flavor? This is an orchata, you guys. I mean, Sammy. This is lemonade. Taste the employee spit. <laughs> Hi, Bobby. Oh, I'll wash them. I got it. You paid oh. for it. Oh, All right. thanks. You keep your drawers. Oh, let on. me have the receipt. Oh, that's for my weed. I'll keep that. I'll throw it out later. If, in fact, if you threw it out, there's still two, two joints in it. Mom's not watching because she saw me smoke weed the other night. She was really mad at me. She said it was high. Not last night, but the night before, Tuesday night. She goes, Diane, you smoked a, you smoked weed. I smoked uh, that vape. And she said, you got seemed high. And she's really critical. So I hope my mom's not watching. Yep, that's right, Kale. <laughs> No, I've never been married. I've been in relationships, but never been married, Pat. You start every day with two edibles, a coffee, a vape, a golf cut right, and a shower to dry my hair. Funny, Nino. Nino has edibles. One coffee, a vape. So you don't, you don't smoke flour, I take it, Nino. This is flour. See, that's what I hate about joints, they go out all the time. Oh, great. I'm gonna pop this one. <sighs> oh. Nice. It's a nice buzz. Yeah, I've got a little bit of a buzz, but still not real strong. Maybe it's because it's a hybrid instead of indica. Still not legal. <clears throat> Surprised in Wisconsin with uh, Madison being a big college town and all that kind of stuff. Maybe medical is legal, but medical is not even legal in Texas, right? I don't think I medical don't know. or I know recreational. Hey, Marquise, how are is. you? Hi, Marquise. Oh, that's good. Me too, Seattle. I I haven't smoked weed since it became legal in California. Uh, recreational. Gypsy. I'm gonna work on the videos tomorrow. I just wanted to concentrate on content with Diane when she was here. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Dingle balls. I have four four reviews coming up. Killed your lungs, huh? This vape went out again. I mean, this joint. 
You probably have to pull through as you're lighting it as opposed to it. Yeah. Go, that's what I hate about these joints. They seem, all joints seem to go out a lot. Yeah, it's gonna, you'll be impressed. Cool, AJ. A lot of people hey, Jeff, take it yeah, for Thank pain. you. Thumbs up. Appreciate it, guys. We are way off in thumbs up tonight. Thank you, off-grid nurse practitioner. I appreciate that. Thank you. A lot of people use CBD only with no THC, and you don't get high off that. I have four reviews had on backward coming. Thank you. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Ah, sit back and enjoy the afterglow. No, I don't watch Smoke and Scan. I've never heard of it. But I know there's people on YouTube that in the morning when they wake up, they smoke. They call it wake and bake. Have you heard of that? They smoke weed and they drink their coffee, I guess, in the morning. <coughs> and then they go on live streams. I don't think we came on with any cheese, did we? Denise? Not big on cheese and um Denise I returned I was gonna buy some but I tasted a sample and I didn't like it and I didn't really want to get any other cheese there. It was brie and I discovered I don't like brie, I never tried it before. The pot smell with little I don't think it can travel that far across Rosie's yard. The pot smell. Yeah, I can smell birds. Could, bird would have gotten a neighborhood high. Oh yeah, I can smell or... birds from here when he's over there sometimes, oh, but shit. it's close. You can smell it all over the place. You walk by the windows inside, it's so infused. Oh really? Yeah. <laughs> Not legal in Indiana. Is med maybe medical is legal in Indiana, not recreation. Yeah, I went to the, I did a video on a Tillamook uh, factory, a cinematic video. I like their cheese too, Ty. Just look at my travel playlist, cinematic travels and adventures, Ty guy on the front page. Ty guy, there. Ty guy, I like it because they don't use animal rennet; they only use vegetarian rennet in their cheese. <laughs> Get legal THC. That thing's firing good now. <coughs> yep. <coughs> I better go away. Three cheese with hot pepper jelly is the bomb. Boom. Boom, boom, boom. I'm just going to let it burn out. It's already almost out. Gone. I'm gonna. I'm not gonna smoke it all right now. I'll smoke some later. But I'm gonna let it go out. I don't want to put it on your concrete. And make a good mark. evening, Brandy. How are you tonight? Needs the Heimlich. Yeah, Ty. <laughs> yeah, it's better than the vapor and strength, for sure. Doing good. Oh, Craig. Yeah, she might be watching. Wow, 
mom's still a mom, no, no matter what the age, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> what a relaxing night. It's a good night for sleeping, nice and cool. Mm -hmm. I better close the window. Oh, it's just up a little bit. I was going to say if the window is all the way up, I get cold in there. Yep, children are always children. That's right. Mm -hmm. Well, I don't know if you'll get rich, but you'll find some interesting stuff. I can do a boofing. I don't know what that means to you. I'm going to probably smoke it. It's not like a roach. It doesn't. It's not real strong yet, but it has this What's chip. up, Urban Adventures? How you doing? No, they're not closed. Are they closed? No. Just... I'm not really affected. I've been hiring this. This is a hybrid joint. If I smoke those indicas, I'll be really buzzed. I'll probably smoke them in the morning or smoke one in the morning when I wake up because I'll be too, like, spacey if I'm on live chat. Space it on there. Yeah. Oh, thanks, Carol. Yeah. <laughs> we have medical marijuana. It must be such a mission to get a card. Are you a medical marijuana in Florida? I didn't know that. It must be such a mission. I didn't know that they finally got it. I think medical marijuana was not a big in Florida for a really long time. Oh, Cindy, yeah, the wake and bake. I should do a live stream this morning from out here when you're sleeping, if you're sleeping. I'm wake and bake. <laughs> this is where you smoke and you drink coffee and you talk. Like right when you wake up. I'll come in my pajamas. I'll do it in my pajamas. It'll be way too cold in the morning out here to do that. Oh. Even if I didn't bring a warm jacket, I just brought the hoodies. Well, I mean, you don't need more than a hoodie. But it's... Oh. Sherlock Holmes, I like that. You never know, I might come out here, Rosie. I won't do a live stream, but I might smoke some. I'm not driving tomorrow, Rosie is, or the Uber is. Celebrating the crows on the rancho. So I got a project to convert and put a timer on the water pump now so it'll never run away and run for days again. Dry and running the electricity bill up to hell. I'm trying to look at myself to see how this looks. A little bit open. That's better. Uh, so I wasn't really, uh, I was more sore being on my feet when I was doing all the, putting up the red sauce and the, uh, baking the apple pie that day. That was a long, that was a lot of hours on my feet. Yeah, it was hot. Yeah, it was we had 90, the fan on. 95 degrees. And the oven was making it really hot and the stove, everything was hot. But I had two, uh, irrigation line links, Catherine, and they basically emptied out the, uh, reserve tank and the well and that caused the pump to just run continuously for days so now I'm putting a timer on it so that will we'll never have that run away again it'll cut off after uh, an hour and a half or whatever so I bought a big electric timer and I'm going to install all that on the back of the shine shack over the weekend can't see it That way I'll be able to travel in peace, yeah. Not have to worry about the, the electric bill exploding. Hi, Kenny. Yeah, my mom said I look stoned. I acted stoned on um, Tuesday. Not the water bill because that's on well water. I don't use well water for the house water anyway. 
Really yeah, I needed the timer, so I'm going to be installing that. <laughs> so it's going to take a little bit of electrical work on uh, on the weekend. So I went with Diane to the Home Depot, got everything we needed this morning. Yeah. I can't really travel in fall because the well just sputters and it's judge weed, but they drink alcohol. I don't think anybody judges weed anymore. Nice hammock. Remember they used to come with them and used to the hammock and she loved it nice. Weed might not be good for your lungs. I asked my physician. Yes, I did, Bunny. The uh, pump was running uh, for the uh, well pump because the uh, well ran. I had two big well, I had two leaks for irrigation lines here. They emptied out the well and it caused the uh, pump to run continuously for days while I was away. I asked my primary physician if marijuana um, causes lung cancer like cigarettes and she said there's not enough known studied on it. There's not, But they might, now that it's recreational a lot of places, they might study it. But people that just smoke marijuana and not cigarettes to see if it, there's a chance of a higher chance of lung cancer. Yeah, there was a crappy, it looked like a cheap ass Mexican restaurant out here, Amelia, like a uh, screen and just a real mess. Yeah, Jay spanked the Yanks. Yeah, and I don't smoke in blunts. I smoke in a bong gypsy and a vape and a this is a blunt I was just smoking because it's cheap. It was only six bucks. I didn't want to spend a lot on a vape. Thank you, Kenny. But I usually smoke a bong with water that filters it. So. Yeah, I had uh, I poured, I built the, uh, framed out the uh, uh, planter boxes, put the electric in the and the uh, water lines into them, and had the guy come in and do the pours, and I had some Mexicans do the finishing on it. And then I poured about a one inch on top of the deck here. <clears throat> that was be just before I start. That was. Before I started my channel, that was the summer of 2011. Getting too cold. Put fencing up. Because the property is the length of a football field here, so it's. I had to put a chain link fence up, get the old fencing taken away, and planted all the 25 or so Lady Banks roses, bushes. Yeah, thank you, Amelia. Yeah, there's a video called What the Rancho First Like It Looked Like When I Moved Here. It was a mess. I got it at the very bottom of the housing collapse. Good night, Catherine. Good night, Catherine. Yeah, I don't. See, yeah, I like my privacy, Bunny. I could. It's zoned. I could put up an apartment building if I want. Twelve unit apartment building. Oh yeah, the bathroom remodel for Missy Jen. Yeah, that was a big one. You should look at the uh, Shine Shack. Yeah, when I get to a homesteading hat on backward, yeah. Back lot veggie homesteading garden. And that's so cute, all the sparkly. Did you light it up? I did not again. No, I will. Oh, okay. If we're out here, I thought you were enough. looking for your lighter. Oh no, no, the lighter's right here. It's your lighter. You want your ketchup? I'll take that. Oh, you already did the dishes, or did you? I'll do them. They're done. Oh, well, do you want me to put this in when I go in? In where? On the kitchen table. Just leave it here. Okay. Yeah. 
Ooh, are you offering, Bunny? We have when the car crashed into the house after getting all that work done, and then some dickhead crashes into the front of the house and takes the hits the corner. It is true. Let's see what the temp is. It's probably about 65 or something like that. It's evening in NorCal. I think so. Okay, where I live, it's 78. That's kind of cool for that compared to how it's been. And here, on thank you, it's 63 at Shell Shows. That's cold. Yeah. Welcome to NorCal. <laughs> you That's have why some people cold. People love living here. I liked it when it was like last night. It wasn't as cold. It better. See, we don't need AC. You guys got to run AC oh, all yeah. the fucking time. Not necessarily in LA, but in the valley we do. Wish it was cold up here. Well, I'm I'm very coastal here. It's a very nice place to live. It is. Yeah, flooring installed all in one piece. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, there's a lot of projects, Amelia. There's building a wheelchair ramp for the front the Weekend Warrior project, building the Wall of Sound. 72 on the mean streets of Lawrenceville, New Jersey. Woo! Well, doesn't the Marine influence come in at night? Don't you have a Marine lair that comes in up there? 75 in Crooklyn, baby. Uh, where would I go, Tio? Uh, thank you, Pauline. Point Reyes was really cool. <sighs> Definitely a good time. the hell would I do in the Midwest to you? Yeah, you can't. Uh, Rancho ain't going anywhere. I got the greedy developers that want to bulldoze everything here and just build up a 20-story, 20 20-unit 20 apartment complex here. <clears throat> That's what I got. Yeah, the ranchos forever. Yeah, I don't know if I'd move to Venezuela. Yeah, I know the developers got a real hard on for it. But I didn't buy it as an investment, I just bought it as a place to live. I mean, where the hell else would I go, right? Yeah, think of the think of the history here. That's right. Good and bad. The whole parade.
Five in and go all Bob Wells on life. Bob Wells doesn't even travel. He's, he's just stationary. He's not even a nomad. Well, your area, Carlos, everybody's leaving Chicago because it's such a shithole now. <clears throat> Crime ridden. No, I worked in college. I worked my way through college uh, on a uh, remodeling and construction. Framing carpenter. And That's so cool. Learned all the electrical, all the plumbing, PEX plumbing, all that shit. Tile work, everything. Yeah, it's a shame. Chicago is a great town, and it's just like, I don't know, man. Well, T.O., there's more than life to life than money. Money doesn't buy happiness. Hey, Magda. Yeah, I'm leaving tomorrow. My plane had a, I had a problem. I made, I thought I booked it for Thursday to leave, but I'm leaving Friday tomorrow. Hey, Magda. I got up this morning, first thing she says is, Rosie, Rosie, I fucked up. You know, I was like, what the hell? What? I thought she lit, I thought she pissed a bed or something. I didn't know what the hell she was talking about. No, but I one time ruined your towel. You know that temporary stuff you put yeah, in to cover right, gray? Yeah, that's right, Jay. You know that when I ruined your towel, that temporary stuff you put in your hair to remove gray by the roots, like in your hair? Um, I had it in and I didn't wash my hair that day, but I washed my face with the towel. I mean, dried it and the stuff got on her towel, but it's not permanent. So it came out, right? In yeah, the, I mean, big in, deal. with bleach. Yeah. yeah, but it was it looked like big poop because it was brown, it looked like poop. <laughs> yeah, I know you, Carlos. Two chicks, you really cut down. You used to have three chicks at a time. By the shine side, using all day. Yeah, well, you what are you gonna do with bird? Yeah. Bird's got a great deal. And he's got the outside uh, He's got the whole patio. He's got the run of the whole joint. Right. right. He's not even wearing a jacket. I can't believe he's it. He's impervious to cold and yeah. heat. Yeah, travel when you want. That's right, Sandy. Ooh, 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 ooh. Living a good life. Thanks, Rooftop. Shanae, you're tiny. Yeah, that's the best thing that Bird ever stumbled into in his whole life. What, the house? Mm -hmm. The tiny house? Yeah. That's easily a fifteen hundred, eighteen hundred dollar a month rental. Wow. Easily. Wow. That's more than my apartment. My apartment is seventeen something. Yeah, it has a shower, it has a refrigerator, it has a sink, it's got cabinets. Ooh, 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 ooh. I didn't build it, I remodeled it. It's a self-contained unit, Bunny. The only thing it doesn't have is a uh, stove because I don't want people cooking in there. Microwave is okay, but not cooking. <laughs> yeah, so I'm an angel. Wait for accommodating me? Oh, for yeah, I bird. Guess, 
So I guess free. he thinks accommodating you for free. Oh, that's nice. I guess he's got to charge you Thanks, so much. Thanks, Tios. Hey, Bliss Bliss, <laughs> how are you? Hey, Bliss Bliss. I met Blackbird in Las Vegas. Did you meet him on YouTube Through first? Through Cap TV, yeah. Did you? Did he have a YouTube channel you went to first? Yeah, I met her people talking about it. I looked in once in a while. And he's here. What a time for a French drain. Woo! Yeah, it's going to be about a third. He's going up a little bit next month, so. Rosie, can I wear that warm jacket in your closet? That, that blue, blue one? In the, in the guest bedroom, that warm jacket? It's blue. With the fleece line? Right. Yeah. Okay, thanks. I'm cold. I didn't bring anything warm. I'll borrow it. <laughs> no, I didn't, Bunny. <laughs> Rabbit paws. No, Shannon, I wouldn't. Uh, for me, no. I'm not ambitious enough for that. I do enjoy cooking. It is fun. Thanks, Rosie. Yeah. Yep. Wearing Rosie's jacket. It's big on me, but it's nice. Is this yep. the one Joseph Kane gave you? Yeah, the one Joe Kane. Yeah, gave this you. is like Sherpa, like my hoodie, Rosie. Yeah, this like is that very, hoodie I wore over. Yeah, don't mess it up. I won't. I won't mess it up, Rosie. Are you teasing me? That's a nice jacket. That's yeah. Joe Kane sent that to me. Do you have another jacket you'd rather Australia. me wear? Australia, huh? Do you have another jacket you'd rather me wear? No, it's fine. Okay. I just need something warmer. Oh, you have the AC on, Kale? Let me see what the temperature is. It's like being with a weather person. Yep. Still 63. I'm a I'm a LA person, so this is cold to me in the at night. It's windy a little bit. It's breezy. This is a little too heavy of a jacket, but it'll do. It's better than the hoodie because I'm not cold. It's sheep fleece lined. I'll take it off if I burn if I smoke a joint to you. Because I thought of that because it's kind of you know I don't want to get burn a hole in it. I'll put my other jacket on temporarily. It's fine. It's just, you know, we you don't have to be that. <sighs> oh, thanks, Rooftop. That's good stuff for you. And very lucky. We went to the store. Is a cat there? Sign to the cat? Right. Yeah. Where do they right. play with their toys at all? Yeah, one of them is over there somewhere. Oh! This one's still here. One of them moved the toy, so... I gave Bert a couple cat toys that I got for free and it, from Walmart. They sent me the wrong package, and um, the um, the cat moved it to the grass from from the concrete. So obviously he liked it. He picked it up or whatever. Well, it's kind of long, and Rosie said this. Don't mess it up. And I don't know if she's joking or serious. So. Serious. 
Yeah, she's serious. <laughs> Don't muck it up. Yeah, so I'll just put on a hoodie. If I get a little ash on it, you know, I would be really upset if I burnt it. My favorite time of year, late August, the dog days of summer. <laughs> nice. I can't believe I'm wearing this form of a jacket in the middle of winter, of summer. It's funny. Coastal California here, NorCal. We got that Alaskan ocean flow. What's the breeze you guys have here? You have a, like a breeze at night? Yeah, it usually comes in around 4.30 and it's done by about 8 o'clock. Oh, okay, because it was really windy out here today when you, when I show, said the sign check was shaking around. Over, over under. Do you want me to stand up, Ty? If you want me to stand up, I will. I'll show you this big jacket. I'm guessing, yeah, I don't know if Point Reyes might be a little warmer than here, I don't know, Point Reyes Station. Good night, Nino. Good night, Nino. Sweet dreams. Yeah, fire pit. I still got the uh, fire pit at uh, Craig, I just didn't fire it up last winter. Because we had the, uh, you know, we had Kitchen Stadium. Yeah, French drains, a lot of work. Been there, done that. You got to put something around so that the dirt and stones don't get in. Yeah, we'll be... Uh, Thank you, Nino. Yeah, she'll be on the video tomorrow, the opening unboxing. Are you going to open in the morning? Mm hmm Okay. The final pie. Yeah, I got up early this morning and showered before Rosie, which is the first time I've ever done that since I've been here, ever. Night, Ronnie. Take care. I guess I'll smoke a little uh, more. Uh, I think I can't remember if Bird helped. Bird might have helped me put it together or raise it. I don't remember. I'm gonna have to light it up here. I don't really remember. I want to say I did it myself, but I don't remember. It wasn't that hard to put up. It's a good size one. Good night, Julie. Good night, Julie. Good night, Hat. All Thank backwards. you, Hat. Good night. Good night, Hat. Right over to you after I blew it that way. There is a pergola over top of this, but it's an open pergola. Yeah, I'm smoking the weed again. I relit the joint, Bianca. This, we went to a different dispensary here. What's it called? Uh, Mercy. Mercy Wellness. I had never been to this one, and when you first visit there, when you sign up, you get a one-cent joint. 
or you get a few other choices. I think you can have a vape, uh, but it's not free. You can get something else. Oh, edibles. You either get ed free edibles or free joints. And they gave me a package Hello, for free. Cheryl. I haven't opened it yet with two little joints. Let me sign up. I don't know if you've been to Mercy or if you smoke weed. Well, I think you said you like weed, but if you ever buy it, you sign up. It's probably worth about six bucks because this joint was six bucks. You know, I've never smoked wax gypsy. I've tr I would try it if someone I knew smoked it. I don't want to buy anything without trying it. Because I think you need a special pipe for that, don't you? You can't just smoke wax. You need special equipment. It's expensive. You grew your own, Bianca? Wow. No, it's some kind of residue from cannabis. I don't know. Is it? Does it have wax in it? Real wax? I don't know. Good evening, EJ. Wax on your card, Jean. Oh, cool, Bianca. Yeah, Bird's doing a lot better. Yeah. I'm surprised Bird isn't growing weed. We could figure it out, cause, cause that. He's, you know, he'd probably like it, enjoy it. Oh, would you allow him to grow it here? You'd have to allow him to grow it here. Why would I have to? Because it's your property. Why would I have to allow it? Because it's your property. Yeah, I could say no. Right. Yeah, you said you'd have to allow him to grow it. Right, you'd have to say yes or no. Yeah. You'd yeah. have to say yes. Yeah. Needs an altar. I'm doing all right. I'm just chilling out. I'm enjoying that uh, In and Out burger with the fries. It was a really good dinner tonight. A nice change of pace. We didn't really spend much on food this whole uh, this whole time, you know. No, we didn't. The only out eating out was In and Out, right? Yeah. And we ate here, but we didn't buy expensive stuff to make. Like we didn't buy salmon or something, you know. I mean, I don't eat salad. Didn't we, do it. We didn't buy frozen food, which would have been expensive. You know, it was so, yeah, it's been a while. It was so nice to bake that apple pie and have that for breakfast. For That's just beautiful. We've had it for two days for breakfast. Three so days. Far. Tomorrow will be three Tomorrow days. will be the fourth day. Oh, will it? Okay. We made it Monday. We've had it Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, tomorrow. Just oh, the yeah. right amount of pie. Dab, Lori? Is that what wax is? I've, I've never tried a dab. Dab in grandma's. Dabbing grannies. The chili was disappointing. Laura, your hair looks great in your profile picture. I did not like the um, uh, Beyond Meat or whatever the hell it was. Lori is my friend, you guys, in case you don't know. We worked together for a long time. I would only ever go with Impossible Meat. Yeah, the I don't like I didn't like the Beyond Meat as much as the Impossible Meat. It was good, but not as good, Bianca. To me, I don't know how rosy it was the same, right? Yeah. No, the uh, the Beyond Meat was sucked. Good night, Flan. <laughs> It's weird because I had a Beyond Meat burger at Carl's Jr. and I liked it, which is like Hardee's and Carl's Jr., so it's a fast food place. Yeah, Beyond Meat just sucked. <clears throat> but you live and you learn. I never really had the two to compare before. It didn't function well in cooking. It was just... Uh, yeah, but what did you think of the Beyond Meat jerky? I gave you, you just Yeah, that was, a, that was okay. Yeah, that was good. And I don't think Impossible makes jerky, at least not yet. Yes, it's just mush. It was just mush. Thank you, Shimei, your sweetheart. Four Impossible brats and sausages, yeah. Oh, I've never tried Impossible Brass and Sausages. That sounds good. I've never tried them. Yes, Kale, they're wonderful. I didn't put this in, so. 
I know. I think they might cook them on the same grill as the burgers. I try to like not think about that, Gypsy, when I go out for it to eat. Because I am a vegetarian, and if I knew that, I probably wouldn't like the juices of the meat in my burger. No, I wouldn't like to see that. So I just pretend that they cook it on a separate place. Remember how I didn't want meat contamination? Meat vapor. <laughs> That's vapor. worse than meat vapor is sitting in the juice of a burger while it's cooking. Meat vapor is in the bag. It infected the... Uh... Okay, I'll try them. I'll try the sausages and the brats or whatever it was. The um, yeah, I think yeah, I think okay. probably so, Amanda. I gotta get some beer and stuff here. And Meat vapors, yes, Bianca. My burger, my cheeseburger, grilled cheese, which had no meat from In and Out, was right next to Rosie's um, burger with meat, and the buns were touching, but none of the meat got onto the, my to mine. But if it did, I probably would be like, ugh, you know. <laughs> Meat contamination. Meat crudies. Meat yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You're not even drinking beer, Rosie. No. Yeah, I just didn't feel like a beer tonight, to be truthful with you. Just um, mm -hmm. enjoying the afterglow of that, um, that in and out. These keep going out, these joints. I don't know why. All joints always go out on me. <laughs> I hate it when vegetables touch, touch my meat. The best for separate bags, huh? Help you hold it in longer? No, because I'll cough maybe. You're Some waste, people you're do. wasting it. Yeah. Well, that's why I smoked. I bought and smoked the whole joint. These are meant to share. You know that, right? Like with two people? No, I don't know that. Uh, well, most people, a lot of people pot. share joints. It's not real strong weed, I do have to say that. The kind I buy at my dispensary, the brand and the, the strain is much stronger than this. And they're both hybrid. I'm not feeling this a lot. Pre-roll burns up too quick and are worth it. Yeah, the pre-roll second. I don't roll good joints and I don't really like smoking joints as much as bongs. Maybe these little joints will be better. They're indica. But they're little. They were free. There's two of them in here. They were a, a penny because I knew I signed up at that, at that um, dispensary. I said, I don't need to sign up. I'm on vacation. I'm just, they go, you have to. We can't sell to you. I had to sign something on the computer screen, my name. I didn't read all of it, actually. No, I don't drink, Lori, if you're talking about me. Oh, Rosie's Mouse about to is, start. I think it's canning season for mouse toes. Rosie's about to start drinking, I think she means. <laughs> Lori said that. <laughs> hey, Ward. It's cold as the witch's tit here tonight. What is it? 60, 62, 63 degrees. It's closer to freezing here than it is to 100 degrees. Neither moo or cluck doodle doodle. Meat sweat. Yeah, Denise, I'm just taking it easy tonight. Yeah, I'm a little, I'm on a quiet side tonight. I'm enjoying myself. Just hanging with the chat. I got the, uh, thinking about how I'm going to engineer the uh, timer for the uh, water pump. No, already, it's not an unusual temperature. It's common here. I'm already pretty packed, so I can be ready in like 10 minutes. Packed. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, she's got a lot going on. Good night, Ty Guy. Thanks for coming in. Good night, Empty Glass. Have a good win. Thank good night. you. Good night, Empty Glass. Whoever. Good night, Ty. He's 
go out all the time. No, never snow, June. Coldest I've had is 18 degrees in December of 2014. And then I, I don't think it's been below 29 degrees the last three or four years because of global warming. Bianca, you're eight bit. Does that have anything to do with bit, with bytes on a computer software, you know, programming? Eight bit? I'm wondering if it has to do with computers. I don't know who this fool is. They're on the wrong channel, whoever they are. Or what does the 8-bit mean, if you want to tell me? 8-bit, okay. Good, Bianca. I think it has something cool. to do with... Uh, gaming, right? Yeah, something to do with gaming with or computer, something like that. With computer, yeah. with programming or whatever. Yeah, we had a good time, EJ. It was fun. First time she'd ever done, um, first time she'd ever done metal detecting. Yeah. Hello, boss. Hi, boss. Windows 11. I'm still running Windows XP. I don't know. Do you want her to come visit you, Judith? <laughs> <laughs> Judith, I have a channel if you want to watch me, Diane. Seems so concerned with your whereabouts and schedule. <laughs> I think Judith has really got something for you. Yeah, it sounds like it. I have Windows XP. I still run it. I think Judith has got a thing for you. Yeah. She said no. Okay. Oh, thanks to you. Yay. I don't think I will. At Miss least not Lulu. right now. Miss Lulu is Miss the Lulu. bomb. Yep. Windows 11. I, how, how is Windows 11? Hey, yeah, I have Windows Sarita, 10. How I are never upgraded because I haven't used my laptop in like two years. My Windows, I have a iPad I use as my laptop substitute. Judith is the one that always checks to see if the rent's been paid and all that. Judith is all about the financial aspects of life. God knows what they uh, charge for um, beer in Mary's these days, a glass of beer. I can't imagine what improvements Windows 11 has over Windows 10. Windows 10 was old, huh? It lasted a long time. Yeah, but it's, you know, what can you do to make Usually, it better? I know, but after Windows 95, they came out with a new Windows like every two years. Same with three years. But Windows 10 was like at least five years at last. Yeah, because they got to sit there with their thumbs up their ass thinking about what we can, what we, can, what can we do to make it, uh, to bring out a new edition. And I know, like, it took oh, them man. forever. Hey, Kelly. Hi, Kelly. Yeah, I love with Windows XP. Yeah, Windows 95 was my first laptop, my first PC I had at home. But at school, I used DOS. Can you believe it or not, at college? Every, every day you're watching the computer in the kitchen is Windows XP over there. Cool. I had a computer with Windows XP, a laptop. I've only had laptops. I've never had a desktop at home. I've worked on them at, at work. Would Diane make a good apprentice? No, I don't think so. Apprentice for what? You have to. You have to have a willingness to learn. I have a willingness to learn. You haven't even edited or done all these. Oh, years that is that what anything. we're talking about? 
cooking. No, but I learned. She doesn't exhibit an interest in. Uh, he is if you'd be an apprentice. Apprentice means you have to be very into, you know, like electrician or. Oh no, I could have gone that way, boss. Um, at the phone company, I could have gone to school and become a, taken the, qu the classes you need and become a technician that, you know, climbed phone poles and stuff and did that type of stuff. A lot of people in my that I worked with became technicians later on. Yeah, you got to do it. You out. can't watch it. You have to do it. Yeah. Technician, I think, is the highest non-management job at the phone company. Yeah, Diane has a lack of effort, yes. And there's inside technicians, too. There were. <laughs> it's a result of being spoiled. <laughs> Gym membership for a year and finally went. That's good. You get run off most jobs. <laughs> oh, that's called communion. Still can't believe I went to the P.O. box today. I'm going to be having an opening tomorrow and then uh, box opening. Some guy comes in with a bag of frozen duck. Anybody want some duck? Yeah, they have drug testing now, yeah. Cool, Bianca. Hey, if you can sit on your ass and get paid, that's a great life. I sat on my ass, the customer service jobs I've had. Yeah, Bianca. you got paid. I got right? paid well, yeah. Do yeah, they have stand-up desks in my last job. Some disabled people had them. They went up and down. You could stand, you could sit. Isn't that random? A guy just comes in the post job with a bag of frozen duck. Yeah, he must have got it shipped to him on blue ice or something. <laughs> I don't know what the hell it was. Yeah. I'm like, dude, you better get the hell out of my face. <laughs> <laughs> His IT tech workers do nothing. He does all the work. Elmer, my Windows XP is wonderful. Hello, Lee Marie. Hi, Lee. It works beautifully. You're a cerebral magna. You're supposed to think deep in metaphysical thoughts. No, I didn't get one, T.O. God knows what's in the duck. Might have been laced with fentanyl or something. I get 78 where I live and it's 63 here still. So where I live, I'd be wearing shorts and a t shirt probably still. Excuse me. <laughs> Sarita. <laughs> Oh, shit. Oh, I'm wearing this jacket while I smoke. Let me take it off. <laughs> yeah, there you go. <laughs> Joe, the boss back in the Navy. Well, did you have to pay to upgrade to Windows 11, or is it just to migrate to it? Yeah, I don't just get random meat from people. Oh, thanks, you know. The fucking guy looked like Albert Einstein anyway. You know, I don't know if the guy was spun around the axle. What the hell the guy was doing? You 
dog duck. <laughs> no, I don't want anything. No, you <laughs> Nothing but vegetarian. Walk around. Yeah, you want dog? Want some dog? Yeah, people that sell bags of shrimp out of the back of their car. People scream when I had tamales out of the back of a trunk of a car. No, I wouldn't say he's the dick of the week. No, <laughs> he was, he was the, he was the uh, goofball of the week. Road meat is the best. It's always a mystery. How you doing? Uh, how you doing, Chef? Hi, Chef. I mean, sticking the bag. Hey, 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 it's dark. <laughs> Dude, you better back way the fuck off. <laughs> I love vegetarian tamale. Not tamale. Yeah, tamales. You better back. Trader Way Joe's fuck off of me. Trader Joe's. Last time I was there, they still had them a couple year, about a year ago. I haven't been to Trader Joe's, but they have uh, cheese tamales, beef tamales, and chicken tamales. I think, or chicken and pork maybe. But I buy the um, the cheese ones. They're vegetarian. I looked at the ingredients. There's no lard. They're really good. Be <laughs> better back way the fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> no, the Mexican guy took it from him, you know. <laughs> like, oh, okay, you know, he took the bag. What Mexican guy? In, in oh, line yeah, line. Office, yeah. But it was an Asian guy offering it, right? Want some dough? No, it wasn't an Asian guy. Oh, it wasn't? I thought it was. Because I know Chinese eat duck, right? They yeah. have, like, pan-fried duck or something. I had duck fried as a child. Yes, Janet, she's as steadfast as a meat eater as you are as a vegetarian. <laughs> Isn't that amazing? Yeah. She won't try? No. No, she's not trying it. They won't try it. Well, you do like macaroni and cheese, right, Janet? That's vegetarian. If you won't, maybe you mean vegan. If it's vegan, you won't try it. Like, Impossible Burgers are vegan. They're not vegetarian. Possible meat is vegan. It's okay these days, uh, Joni, because they found that it's a disaster for the population of one yeah, child policy. Hey, Luce. Loose. He's <laughs> too funny, Cheryl. No, I just make salads. I buy, you know, cut up spinach and cut up romaine sometimes. She grated cheese. Um, I cut. Up, I get those cherub <laughs> tomatoes and onions. The trunk fish. <laughs> and Thousand Island dressing. Uh, the trunk fish. I don't fish. cook much. Hey, Justin. I love that. The trunk fish. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, it's really good. Vegetarian. Sometimes I put hard boiled egg in it too, if I have it. I, uh, I th you think I could do pretty well vegetarian. I didn't have yeah, that. because you make that yeah. spaghetti. You made that eggplant parmesan. No, but I mean, I don't. You know, I've eaten all vegetarian stuff, and it didn't. I but could you get, like eggplant parmesan? I could. You do made it. it without me even being here. You made it, and that was yeah. vegetarian. And you made pasta with no meat. Yeah. Without me. I here. think I could do just fine. On that. Yeah. Yeah, I can do vegetarian. You just have to go to Burger King or. Carl's Jr. Nice, Elmer. Email, if you wanted a burger. Look at the specs on that thing. 32, wow. 32 gig, one terabyte. Wow. Wow. Yeah, I do like keto. Hi, Boston. Boston, Mark. How are you? Good to see you. Thumbs up or appreciate it. If you're coming in, please take a second to hit the thumbs up. Yeah, I can do vegetarian. I don't feel like... I feel like I, when I do vegetarian, I'm not really being denied anything in my diet. Still, still, like if I could have impossible meat, not the beyond meat. You can get fun. that at Burger King. Yeah. If you don't, if you're fast food, yeah. 
And we've had like, uh, I think some of the chicken things and things like that. Yeah, good. the chicken baka you like. You've never tried the chicken nuggets. Those are good. Some browns are better than others. Morningstar's good chicken nuggets. It's amazing the flavors that they get in. Morningstar Vegetarian makes... Vegetarian food, it's amazing. Morningstar Farms makes different flavors of the nuggets. They make uh, buffalo, ranch, plain. Yeah, they make three kinds. They're all good. HP Crumble. Tamales from Guatemala. Okay. I'm going to have to get a Chromebook because it's nice and light to travel with. That's what my mom has. Yeah. She has a big one. They're very nice She's a 15 to she has a 15.6 one. I need to take one. one into the sports book with me with my shit. Okay, my mom got a 15.6, not an HP notebook, but a Chromebook. <laughs> she got it a couple of years ago. <laughs> Look what the ball said. <laughs> oh, funny, Dave. Boss. That's true, and if a vegan kisses someone that's not a vegan, they're going to get mean in them. So. Or I did the, think about that at one point. Or the monkey pox, right? <laughs> or the monkey pox. <laughs> I'm just cute all over, Bianca. <clears throat> Way too much on. I Dorito bikinied up and was laying out kind of like drifted into La La Land a little bit. Ooh, we don't eat red meat. Uh, a Chromebook appeals to me because when I travel and I go into a sports book, it's, uh, you get 15 hours of battery and uh, it's, it's lightweight, so it's not a lot to haul around. Miss Lou, you're so sweet. Twenty four ninety nine, two thousand four hundred ninety nine euros. We went to In and Out Burger. Diane had a grilled cheese. I had a hamburger and some fries, and we got drinks. I wonder if in and out if they cooked my grilled cheese anywhere near the meat, like on the same grill. Well, they didn't grill it, they just, it was warm though, so I don't know what they did to I'm it. I'm betting that in and out being a quality establishment, I bet that they cooked that on a separate grill. Yeah, they probably I think did. it's just the way that they do shit. They yeah. just, they don't cut corners. Yeah. Right? <clears throat> Burger King, you know those impossible whoppers are going on the same griddle with the meat juice. Probably, it's gross. I try not to think about it, but you're probably right. I went to a restaurant once that served veggie burgers, and I asked them to make it on foil on the grill, and they did. They said they did. Like, on a flat grill, instead of putting meat, where they put meat, they put foil. Yeah, they said they had a fire, but that was almost two years ago, Beyond. It's some kind of bullshit. They couldn't get the staff. And that's a shame because that guy ran that thing so beautifully. Yeah, it looked like a lot of kidney learn your lesson. Oh, yeah, in, in and out employees are very good. Yeah, they are good. I'm really impressed with what they do, like the uh, non-meat sausages. <clears throat> so I've, I've gradually been introducing a little more vegetarian into my uh, diet. I am really cold, I can't believe this. Oh, the Burger King was good. This guy ran a really good operation. I really like that Impossible Whopper. It was real good. Yeah, they're good. Yeah, really. Uh, ooh, ooh. 
Jack in the Box is good. I can get the uh, Junior Jack still for like a buck eighty nine a pop. Damn good deal. Lettuce, tomato, pickle. I don't know. I really, I rarely have. Uh, I can't remember the last time I got something from McDonald's or Wendy's or I think just during a taste test or something. Good organic burgers. Yeah, animal style. Did you know they have animal style fries too with that? Grilled onions and uh, spread. Stick with non processed food. I don't think I eat a ton of processed food. And I think cheese. Cheese, spread, and onions on fries. Huh, stop selling strawberries and shakes. Oh. I'm not a big shakes person. I like vanilla shakes, but like I do like strawberry. Like if Janet is having vanilla ice cream or something, I'll have it. Or if she puts out a cheese plate, I'll have it. But I don't buy my, you know, I just don't get enough out of it to put ice cream. And when Missy Jen was here, I'd always pick up ice cream for her to enjoy. My favorite is vanilla, then I like strawberry, then I like chocolate at burger. I mean, with those three flavor shakes. Most people like chocolate the best, but I know. Like when I was a kid, didn't most of your friends like chocolate cake the best, like birthday parties? Yeah, chocolate with yellow, yeah. And yellow, mine was always cake, white. Yellow cake with chocolate frosting. Mine was always white with white frosting. I used to like fillet fish. They're expensive. They're not, and they're small. They're Good really night, expensive. Amanda. Thanks for coming in. See you tomorrow. They're like the, they're like more than a Big Mac, I think, and they're half the size. Oh, look at that. I would agree, Justin, but I would say that uh, In and Out Burger has a very high standard of performance. And they when don't you, freeze their meat. Did you know? Wouldn't that? you say they have a high standard? Did of you performance? know they don't freeze their meat? It's all fresh. Yeah, they have high standards. Who else makes grilled cheese? I mean, that's pretty cool. They've been making that for years before the veggie First time I had cheese. Sonic, I went down late towards closing, and they gave me an old hot dog that it had chili on it for hours, all soaked in and all nasty. But that's my fault for going at the end of the night. You want to have something horrific? Eat, eat Amy's vegan mac and cheese if you want to taste something horrendous. Oh my God! But Amy's makes non-vegan mac and you cheese. You would enjoy eating the cardboard it sits in more than the food. Amy's frozen mac and cheese that's not vegan, just regular. It has, Amy's uses cheese; they're vegetarian. Is good, but I think they only use rice noodles because they're gluten free. So. I prefer regular noodles than rice noodles, than gluten-free noodles. So I usually don't buy Amy's macaroni and cheese. But they do make vegan too and frozen. Rosie, hey Brenda, how Rosie you doing sampled, sweetie? Good to Rosie see you. Rosie sampled the vegan one. Oh, I did a food review for the channel and Missy Jen and I just looked at each other and almost started weeping. Funny loose. Did something could did they could put something out to eat that tastes so horrific? Wine country. If you're talking about um, In and Out, I'm sure they're good, but I I don't eat the chili.
Now, say the hack job chili with impossible meat is excellent. Oh, yeah. I wouldn't eat the chili on my fries. I would get the... I probably would get the animal fries because it has cheese. I'm a vegetarian. Grilled onions, unless they're made with meat on the I, grill. Yeah, I don't believe... If I made chili with impossible meat, I don't think anybody would be able to tell there was no, meat. No, I can't tell. I mean, I haven't had meat in years, but much different. Even the texture and the graininess, the little particles are the same. The chewiness. I'm curious, where did you learn all you know about? Because uh, as a kid, I went out to eat like three or four days a week usually, or three days a week usually, growing up. So... Um, yeah, I'll probably have to pick up a few things at Grocery Outlet tomorrow. I got some electrical work to do here. Saturday project. <laughs> Chef, it was so bad. There's a pseudo. Yeah, I've seen that guy before, Joni. I mean, I was eating falafel when I was like 11 years old. Falafel's good. But I was eating it when I was a kid, yeah. before it was popular. You know, Tabula, so you know. I ate all that stuff before it was popular with... Baba like Ganoush. Like it is now. Met, yeah. Dolmas. Now there's falafel and stuff a lot of places, a nice, but... A nice shawarma. When I was a kid, falafel was not popular. A nice shawarma. Shawarma, I've had... No, nice, I've EJ. Had that. But nothing like a good baba ganoush. Oh, yeah. I had that when I was a kid, too. When I was about 11 or 12. My mom liked it. My mom likes uh, Middle Eastern food, Mediterranean, Greek food. Yeah, I like uh, I like Middle Eastern food, too. Uh-huh. She always has hummus, my mom. She dips carrots in it. She doesn't eat a lot of bread. I remember going to a, a Persian restaurant in Chicago. It was wonderful really good Persian mm -hmm. my mom's been to Persian really good Persian my restaurant. mom's been to Ethiopia which I've never been kebabs and rice now my it's mom really knows a lot about food she's been just about everywhere and she's traveled the world so, well she's been to Europe a few times and Israel so she's eaten a lot of weird unusual foods birds getting a lot of use out of that rebuilt console yeah, it's nice. I just don't like the tabulas with extra garlic. It's terrible. I've never had that way. Well, but oh. I've had some better than others. I don't like when it has too much grain in it. Have you ever had that? Too much yeah, of the fiber? I can do the grain. Sometimes that's too much. It's not good. But it's, you know, when somebody insists on having extra, extra garlic. And yeah. Oof. Garlic and hummus extra I don't like either. They make a garlic hummus. Tear, tear them up. It's weird because I like garlic bagels. You, I know you only like sweet bagels. Yeah, I don't like onion and garlic. Right, bagels. you don't like. Say, I don't like to have that breath, like, breath in the you morning. You like blueberry, right? Cinnamon yeah, raisin. Yeah, I don't want that onion right. breath in the morning. Right. People smell like they ate a goat <laughs> or something. Coming into work in a call center <laughs> with goat breath. Jesus. Well, eating my veggie omelets, I get onion breath because I usually get onions on them. You know. Yeah, I bet it is, Lee. The rooter to the tutor. Yeah, the campus. I used to, wine country, I used to get uh, Middle East, Eastern food, a place called the House of Curries near Berkeley. Hi, Mandy. House of Curries. Hey, Mandy. You rarely wear this jacket, huh? On, on yeah, we matches. haven't really been that cold uh, this lately, these winters. Yeah, you mostly wear that lightweight black jacket, but you say it keeps it warm, right? Yeah. yeah. 
That wouldn't keep me warm, I don't think. Yeah, they're getting ready for the weekend, Craig. This one goes out to the one I love. Hey, Nicole. Temperature's probably 62, 63. I can tell you what it is at Charles Schultz Airport, according to this app, weather bug. Go ahead, man. Just go ahead with your bad self. Yep, Shemay's birthday Sunday. Okay, it's 75 in Sherman Oaks, where I live. God, what a drag to start school in all 60. It's only 60 here at Charles Schultz Airport. What is it, 60? 60 at Charles Schultz Airport, yeah. Here's the cats. Hmm. Play with your toy in front of me, cuties. There's baby socks. Ooh, 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 ooh. Yeah, that's the way it used to be after Labor Day. What do the cats do when it gets real cold, like in the winter at night? Do they live outside? Just go under a house or something. Oh. They do okay. They do okay? Yeah. Because in my neighborhood, it doesn't get this cold. Anymore. They'll all be in bed with birds. Sure. <laughs> Seeing as he sleeps with the door open at night and stuff. Uh, and he actually fixed the curtain, he actually fixed the blinds on the door. Amazing. Because Bert said they're all wild, right? None of them are like pets that live at home, probably. <laughs> it's true, Brenda. They'll all be in the shine shack. taking college classes? Or were you just on campus? My flight leaves, I think it's at 145. Hold on. Yeah, the boss is going to teach basic electric theory. Basic electricity theory. Wait till he yells at the first student. My flight leaves at 150. Can you imagine the boss is a professor? <laughs> Damn. Nicole, my flight leaves at 1.50, so I'll probably get there like an hour and a half early. Probably show, bro. And my seat is really good. I'll show you guys my seat. If it doesn't show my name. You think the you boss can, be a good teacher? You can chase change seats on the app. Okay, I'm in the 12th row, and there's 17 rows in the plane, so that's not too bad. Those are my initials, DC, if you can see it. And there's someone sitting next to me, and these are the empty seats, the blue ones right here, and the top blue ones. So, I'm like in the middle, see? Like, there's seats, of, there's a little bit of first class up here. This is like luxury class, or whatever they call it, preferred class. And then there's me, and look at all the rest of the rows. I like the way you can do that, move seats. Like, I had my own, nobody next to me, someone sat next to me, so I moved a couple times to where I didn't have to sit next to someone. Now I have no choice. I already got my boarding pass and all that. I don't think I can change. I know probably the window seat is safest when you're rocking around, but I go up to potty usually once or twice, usually at least once, sometimes twice. It's only an hour and 20 minute flight about, but I don't usually go at the airport right away. I sit there for like an hour before the plane you, takes off. You see what P2E said? What? Yeah, I don't. No, I don't. <laughs> Sometimes I don't have a neighbor, but no, I've never asked Flying them Flying is very safe, Brenda. Ooh, ooh, 
What is that, Nicole? So you don't have to sit next to an old guy or what? Oh, that's nice, Nicole. Yeah, I do it on the app. You probably she, can't ask Nicole's at the counter. An, Nicole's an ageist. Yeah, they'll change it at the ticket counter. I'm probably. not sitting next to this old son of a bitch on the plane. <laughs> Thing is, is you don't know who you're going to sit next to. So, la last two times I've sat on people that fit in their seats, but what if I sat on someone that was like hogging over my seat? That wouldn't be good. Well, how would you like it on a 15 hour nonstop flight? I wouldn't. That's why they have the first class for the people that can't fit in those kind of seats. Or whatever it's called, luxury class. Yeah, what if the person sitting next to has meat papers or eating a big meatball soon? <laughs> well, people bring food onto the plane that they could buy at the airport, so if they bought it onto the plane, I, I don't care if people eat me next to me. Right next to me, I don't care. On your gravy hamburger steak, I'll sit with you, Danny. <laughs> sure, that's hey. fine. Da that's kind, boss. I, like I said, I don't know anybody else that's vegetarian except me. All my friends eat meat. And all my family eat meat. $14,000 to fly to Armenia? Come on! If you're talking to me, Janet, I do. Are you kidding me? What the fuck? You could fly from Moscow to... Or An Ankara or Istanbul there? Shit. Yes, Janet, I agree. I what? keep mine, like I put my backpack in my bag oh, right oh, in that's front of me. Oh, first class. I don't want it to sneak over to the other side where the other seat is. <laughs> I forgot. Magda goes first class. I think. <laughs> This is just a short flight. You're, you're out of there before you know it. And they give you a drink and like half hour through it in the middle of the flight, they give you, a, they go around and give drinks and snacks. Let me tell you, Pete Carver, twice a month I would go from Hong Kong to London and back 15 hours, 15 and a half hours flying to London nonstop from Hong Kong and 15 hours coming back. <clears throat> you talk about going out of your mind. Did I tell you that first class and the luxury class for their snack, they get a big bag of all kinds of chips. And we just get these little packets of pretzels in their choice. They, they go around with the basket. I've seen them do it. It's kind of cool. That's their snack on that flight. No, I don't watch a movie. There's some kind of on the plane internet Wi-Fi that you can only, it's free and you can watch their videos or their movies or their TV, but I don't do that. I just play on my phone, even though you don't have Wi-Fi. Yeah, your, your seat doesn't even get warm. You take off, you reach your peak altitude, and then you just start to descend. It's a very fuel-saving flight. Yeah, I know, Nicole. I can watch them on my iPad, too. I can watch movies that I probably download, or I can watch DVDs. Oh, no, I can't. Not on my iPad. On my laptop, I can watch DVDs. Did you ever get into DVDs for movies? No. No? I did. Only for the real classic movies that I like, that I saw. God forbid they put an old person next to Nicole on a plane. You think Richard I'm Simmons? sitting next to this son of a bitch? It's missing Mr. Simmons. Honey, I'm still on, I'm still on vinyl. live stream. Funny Nicole. I use a potato. <laughs> uh, 
Oh man, do I, yeah, I have a Yeah, battle. flying would always be dress up, Justin. Absolutely. It was an event. It was fun to fly. You didn't have the hassles of TSA. And man, I love to fly. Mag, I have about 30 DVDs. Some Listen I bought to used. Stories. Yeah, and he's alive, Scottish. The shadow knows. <laughs> as far as I know, the last time. He's just isolating himself from the public. Ooh. Look him up. There's uh, and Google it, Google it, and there's probably talking about whatever happened to what how's he doing and stuff. Mm -hmm. Well, I think they did a wellness check on him. Somebody did a wellness check on Richard Simmons. Wow. Christmas dinner. I used to, Nicole. I don't watch movies anymore. I haven't been into movies for like 10 years. But when I used to watch Crow, movies. Let me tell you, Crow, that kind of flying will tear you up for a week. That shit will tear you up for a week. And I, I have a lot of DVDs, like box sets. Like I have the Brady Bunch box set. I have, you know, I have music video, like I have Michael Jackson DVD and U2 DVD. I have some DVDs that are non-movies. Just TV shows and stuff. What else do I have? No, just the box set of the Brady Bunch. That's all, the only TV show I have. <laughs> the Golden Girls. What, so you can, cool, make, you can make fun of them or what? I like the Golden Girls, Nicole. King Crab. Good Lord, that's expensive. Laser nice. Just the right amount of meat these days. Look, bros, they got a new shirt. Look how nice it is. Very nice. Oh, nice. Was that one of your gifts? Yes. That's nice. It looks so cool. Uh huh. Yeah. Come up close. I want to see it. You're all preppy now. Oh, yo. Let's see. Come close. That's nice. Very nice. Yes. Mm -hmm. Do, do, do. Looking good. See if Bird remembers to turn off the lights in the shine shack. Let's see. Before he heads off on a deer run. Nice is in a Brit. Do, 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 do. Yeah, crab is ridiculous. I wouldn't want to see, um, you know, Alaskan crab too much. I can't believe I'm freezing up here. Like the winter almost. Yeah, I know you like it, but good lord. I don't think in my life I ever had Alaskan king crab. Ooh, 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 ooh. No, not this year, insane. It's just too, it's too ridiculously expensive now to go. Hey, seal hater. Watch this. Blackbird. Lights, please. Lights. Lights. Shine shack lights, please. Help me with the bill. 
Thank you. Appreciate it. We all do our part. I miss my Maryland blue crab. Somebody told me it was like $118 a dozen or something now. Holy shit. You know? <sighs> Ooh, well, if you're going to leave, don't leave the lights on. It's insane to pay that for crabs, for blue crabs. It's ridiculous. I used to think $49, 50, 60 bucks a dozen was a lot. <sighs> yeah, good. Go on that cod crab combo this year. I had to cook and freeze them. Nice. Grab some, make some crab, crab gravy. Yeah. What's the name? Bodet. I'm Jim Bodet, and we'll leave the light on. Yeah, a lump of crab meat, 50. That seems like a bargain, chef. You might be getting the institutional price on that shit. I don't know. No, I'm you a little got tired. Quiet. No, I'm a little tired. I don't know. Maybe it's the weed. Maybe I'm just a little tired. I got you. Well, we've been on four hours tonight. Yeah. Yeah, Motel Six. I'm Tom Bodet. We'll leave the light on. Do 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 do. Do 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 do. Hey, ghost. Ghost, how you doing? So I'm saying, Justin, they put down like a paleo crab or some, and they salt the water so much it's terrible. <clears throat> and they'll want to charge you seventy-five, ninety dollars for the buffet. Screw that. Thank you, EJ. Actually, I hope I can just close my suitcase. It was so full on the way here. I might have to sit on it to close it. That's what I'm worried about. <laughs> I might have to ship back some of my clothes. I might have to pay Rosie to ship it back. If they want fit. Hey, I've got Dave. So much stuff. Costco case price. I don't know. Hey, Dave. Well, thank you, Haunted X. How sweet. <clears throat> thank you for being part of the stream. Thank you, Haunted X. And then um, tomorrow I'll start to work on uh, getting the Vegas content up. Got four, few, four food reviews to come up. Good ghost. And that'll be fun. Good night, Elmer. My day has been really good today. I'm going to take another cup of this joint. No, I'm going to open a new joint. About how much longer are we going to be out here? I'd say about 10 or 15 minutes. I'll just take a couple minutes. I'm really proud of you. I couldn't even burn it. Yeah, I'm just saying, Chef, that's the way I feel. I always go for the high dollar item. 
like the uh, oysters on the half shell and the high dollar shit. But they just, they salt that water and, um, you know, they make that crab legs like inedible because they don't want you to be eating them and they don't use a decent quality crab. You see this deadliest catch, they got like tons of these crabs going in. Thank you, EJ. It's like son of a bitch, right? Where are those crabs going? China? I think I'll try this still. It's just kept going out on me. Cheryl, I don't know if you'd say that. It's been a few years since you've been down there. Well, Lee, I might have one left over. I might smoke one tomorrow in the morning before I leave on my flight. Because I'm either taking an Uber or Rosie's driving. So I'm not, I don't drive after I get high. So Or after I smoke, whether I not get high or not. And then um, I'll leave one. I can give one to you, of course. Lee. I'll, give it, I'll tell Rosie to give it to Bird. If I have it left, the other one. Take care, Craig. Thanks Good night, for Craig. coming in. Thank you. Good night, EJ. Good night, EJ. Yeah, like twice a year, he's buying a heavy. I got no idea, Chef. It baffles me. Sarah Winchester. I didn't ever do... I went to San Jose one time and I just thought it was a very I boring know. place. See, it keeps going out. It's crazy. Do you have to keep up? Yeah, I know. I don't. And I don't take big you cups light either. When you're, you gotta you take big cups. You have to light cups. it while you're pulling. Yeah. Not, not in the air. That's not the way to light it. You have to... I don't want to burn my hair. My eyelashes. I don't want to burn my eyelashes. Forget it. It's. I think this needs to be taken off. Cool. Yeah, I'll probably like. You don't have an ashtray, do you? Nope. Ten pounds for two hundred twenty-nine dollars. I'm in the wrong damn business. Yeah, Dave. Boss, I'm gonna light the other one. Just take a couple puffs on, and I probably won't finish either one. If I can figure out how to open this. I'll let Rosie, she's a whiz at everything. I'll what? let her open, figure out how to open this. You might need a scissors. If not, I'll go get a scissors if you can't figure it out. <laughs> Thank you, see you later. Thanks, Rosie. There you go. Thank you. Oh my God, these little, little selfies. Dink, little They're called selfies. Oh my God, they are so cute. Look at these little joints. They have little writing on them. I've never seen little cute little joints like these. How cute. Okay, they were a penny for two of them because I, I signed my name to a document saying I was over 21 and all this other stuff. And then I agreed to smoke their weed and... I don't know, it was, I didn't even read it. It was a long, and I signed it so I could get in there. No, the other one tasted better than this one, but the other one wasn't that strong. So, and it burned down. It, it has this much left on it, and I can't burn it. It keeps going out every time we light it. Well, it's a freebie, right? No, this one was $6. Plus yeah. These are freebies. No, these are good. So far, I've only taken one hit. They're light. They're staying lit. <laughs> the 
quality's not as good. Because <coughs> that one did, <coughs> this one makes me cough, the other one didn't. <sighs> Wine country, I'm tired. I went, um, I'm just tired. I almost fell asleep in Rosie's uh, recliner. I hear how quiet it is tonight. Because yeah. tomorrow's a school day. The kids are in school. We for free on tomorrow on the program. <laughs> We're getting ripped off back and we can take one ball and get stuff out of Sandy, no I'm not. I'm like No, I needed back in the day when I was a teenager the pot wasn't as strong as it is at the dispensaries and one bong hit wouldn't do anything. Now it does. Back in the day I couldn't I took several bong hits. Might bring it to me. Good night, June. I am kind of quiet tonight. I feel kind of chill. I might be tiredness. Diane sees a while. That's what you time. like to have, a little bit of chill, yeah, right? Yeah, I'm in a little bit of chill tonight. I'm not in a like, laughing mood, really. Ooh, 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 Dave, contact oh, ooh. oh, thanks, Dave. Bird picked up his super burrito. Diane's leaving tomorrow, Sue. So. Battery 15. Oh, I guess we're going to go ahead and shut it down, too. How much more you got on that thing? Oh, it went out. Maybe they all go out if you don't puff on them. I don't know. I think they do. I haven't smoked a joint in so long that I forgot if they go out and puff on them. That's why when you pass it, it stays lit. You pass, pass to a friend, pass, pass. Yeah, pretty much all gone, CO8. Or like pass at a real concert. Nice. Been real good. Good night, Cheryl. Cheryl said good night. Good night, Cheryl. Good night, Johnny. Good night, Johnny. Charlotte, keep up the good work, honey. You're doing a great job. Good night, boss. Thank you, Squirrely. Good night, Janet. Yeah, thank God the joint's vegetarian. Yeah, it's vegan, actually. Well, if it was grown with fertilizer, it might be vegetarian. Because that's an animal product. Yep, later, gang. <laughs> All right, y'all. We'll see you tomorrow. Thanks for the thumbs up if you haven't hit it. Thank you to my wonderful moderators, Patricia Wakefield. Shout out to you. Hope that you are well. And, um, yeah. Good night, everybody. Good night. It's nice seeing you, We'll Rosie. see you on the... Um, Live. Do a recorded video for tomorrow, okay? Oh, Got some opening. All right, okay. guys. Box opening Bye. tomorrow. Bye. And there we go. Okay. I thought we were going That's live. It.